Hello everyone, welcome to my shameless dive. Today we have Mr. Saito, which which is uh, it, it's it's going to be a lot of random dialogue and and stuff. I don't know if you have played Raccoon, but it's made by the same pe person who made that. Who is also the same person who sung the lovely song at the end of To the Moon, and the same person who did the the um, zombie song in uh, Plants vs Zombies. So Laura Shigahara was released literally just a couple of days ago, so I figure it's perfect for the shape of style. However, it is very voice heavy, and I need some help for that. So obviously, I asked not Para. I asked Foosh. Hello, Foosh. It me. So yes, I this is. A this is another friend, so I, I hope you're ready for this. You've got such I think an you've intimate made a mistake. You've got an intimate knowledge of the Raccoon universe, right? <laughs> yes, definitely. <laughs> I'm well versed with all of these things, and I know all of these words that you've said. So, so here's the hope that there's no real links because uh, she's never played it before. We did play To the Moon though, right? Once, yes, about this way. yes, yes so, we did. I think there were be tears shed, not on my part. <laughs> Look, look, I've only <laughs> played it like 12 times. What do you expect? <laughs> How have you not been numb to it already? You know, you're not, like, I will never be numb! <laughs> I will never be numb. Very well then, you do you. All right, let's see what Mr. Sato's all about. So, as usual, it's got this very complicated control scheme. <laughs> Arrow keys Ooh. and space and enter. I'm Beautiful. glad I'm not playing. I know, I know. Well, I do need you though. I need you to um, add silly voices to to people. That's well, not pretty. too silly, but yeah. Who cares? Can She's do very good uh, I mean, I'd rather he didn't. Uh, just, <laughs> I, I'd say probably don't do anything that will get my uh, channel in any way demonetized. Not that it's, not that it's monetized in the first place, but like, if I have to delete mm. it at a later date, probably not a great idea. Sure. Oh. I think he might have a drinking problem. Me too, man. Oh, well, we all know where this is, then. We do? It's, it looks like the hospital from Rakuen, which would be make sense for the link. Oh, but yeah, I know what that is. Exactly, exactly. Uh, who, who's there? Do I have to do I, that one? I guess that can be you, yeah. At least we'll be talking back and forth a bit until we find out who it is. <laughs> okay. Who, who said that? Me. Uh, wh where are you? Come and find me. I didn't know this was going to be a horror game. I'm. <laughs> <laughs> oh bloody hell! Okay. Mm. All right. Let's let's go find the strange. Let's go find the strange. Um. Oh, Disembodied hello. voice. Yeah. Uh, this is fun, and it's so lovely and red out today. Oh. In the toilet. Ah, uh, sure. Why not? <laughs> I'm definitely not in there. Well, you never know, do you? You don't. Okay. I, I this don't. This like you, idiot. I mean, fair. I, I, the problem is, there's nowhere else in here, so I'm gonna guess that I'm gonna go backwards. Um, where else could this disembodied voice be? Unfortunately, text doesn't have surround sound. Check under the bed. Sometimes they keep extra blankets in there. Why are you in my room? Nope, not in the bed. Nope, not there. I mean, I'd be pretty worried if it could fit in a beaker. Bah! Wrong! I'm just gonna click on everything because that's generally how this goes. Wait, are you gonna be in the other drawer? You really think I could fit in there? Honestly, I don't know. How am I supposed to know? I can't even see you. In fact, I can't see any more places to look. Except for this plant. It's hard Is to see. Is light? I, I 
Do you see any light switches? That's the problem. I don't see any light switches right now. I'm feeling like I, I'm feeling rather inept, really. Hmm. Hmm. I'm guess. Well, there's only so many things it could be. Oh. I, oh. I don't think I'm supposed to leave my room. Well, I'm not supposed to be out of bed. I don't think you're supposed to be walking around. Well, unless you're in my bloody saline bag, I don't have many options. I don't know if that's me or you. Uh oh. I I heard that. You're in the corner. Wait, but what corner? We checked the toilet before. Yeah, we definitely looked in there. Um but you heard that in the corner. <laughs> I just Which... want you to fill the sink to drain it again. <laughs> I I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. In the corner. Why did the the light turned on? Oh, I see. I've got to do that. And then I came back out here. Oh, no. How did I... How did I trigger that? Oh, do I have to relook at everything again? Is this where, this is where we're at in life? Where I've got to relook at everything? He said, you're in the corner, which means it would have been the plant. And the light did come on, so... Oh, no. But the light's now not on. Cool. Well, the problem is the... The light is it's no longer on so i guess we try okay never mind the light just was uh, off it wasn't on it wasn't off it, it was already on it just we couldn't see it we went back to our bread today so that makes more sense come, come out of there uh, oh <laughs> is there some reason you're out of bed and walking around well, I was just talking to a plant, to be honest. I, uh... Please, Mr. Saito. I'll go back right away. But can you move that plant a little bit closer next time? Hmm. You really don't want to be moving around right now. Uh, I mean, you're right, but... I know it's easy to go a little stir crazy in here, but you gotta remember. If you rest and let your body heal, you'll be out of here in no time. And then I can drink more booze. <laughs> so no making it worse, okay? Fine. I apologize. <laughs> no worries, just take it easy. We had quite a fall after all. Team will be back later today for your follow-up scan. So why don't you get some sleep for now? Two questions. Two questions. One, where is the light switch? <laughs> Two, where's the bloody TV? Like, when I was in a hospital in the middle of the night, I was watching important documentaries. I couldn't go to sleep, so I turned on the TV and there was a documentary about the mating habits of a shotgun bird, and they danced. They went, wah, wah, wah. It was very cute. <laughs> that is cool cute. story. Yeah, I'm, look, I, I only tell the best. And and it's, it's not just because it's 5.07 a.m. Mm-hmm. Okay. A normal time. Exactly, completely normal time to be recording. What are you talking about? Take care, Mr. Saito. Stay in that bed. <laughs> oh God, a child. I thought she'd never leave. Uh, why are you in my room? And I'm Brandon. Let's go. <laughs> no, I don't. No, no, no. But seriously, why out of all names in 2023 would you choose that name? Stop. <laughs> uh. I didn't ask your name. I asked why you're in my room. And for the record, I have nothing for or against Joe Biden. I'm an Australian. I would have voted for Sanders. Good disclaimer. <laughs> Just this one. Like sure. okay. Oh, God. This kid is bloody selling to us. Hustling you. 
I mean, I do, re I do respect the hustle. Got, gotta say. Uh, what? N no. I love making friendship bracelets, and I've gotten pretty good at it. <laughs> Look at this pattern. God damn it! This kid is, this kid is like an entrepreneur. <laughs> Who even like, invited you? I don't know. And why did he get to the plant of all places? I, it's a weird sales pitch. Pretty good, eh? Uh, sure. <laughs> he looks so disinterested right now. <laughs> <laughs> There's not a whole lot to do here. That used to make me sad. Because I have a lot of goals, you know? For example, I want to run my own business selling the crafts that I make. Great, great. <laughs> Get out of here, man. So I awesome. also want to help people. Aww. One day I realized I can still do those things here. Yeah, the quite... Too many lofty goals. Yeah, I know, though. Trying to work out, like, could that be the character from Raccoon? Before he had his chemo and lost all his hair? It's it's a non-zero chance, actually. Uh, no comment. Well, yeah, you wouldn't. You you haven't played Raccoon yet, so yeah. I wonder if it's meant to be the same person. I can't tell because you know you put a hat on someone and they're a completely different person. Yeah, true. <laughs> I feel that way in real life too. Exactly. Exactly. Like so here I am. New mustache. Wow. Hello. Welcome. <laughs> Hello, new person. <laughs> exactly. I, I, I see. God, he is such a boring fan for this kid. Right. What are you in here for? Murder. I, uh, I fell down. Right. I couldn't get back up. Did he try to unalive himself? Maybe. I mean, you did uh, see how he was. Wasn't positive. Right. <laughs> Does it hurt a lot? It, it did at first, but now it's not so bad. They pumped me so full of drugs. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh God. They got pretty good medicine here. Wow. I, see? This kid knows about all the drugs. Oh, there he goes making some fresh bracelets. <laughs> what? Okay, that's better than I thought he was. I thought he was going through the shelves for some drugs. I was like, whoa, <laughs> okay. Where'd you go? I, I, I don't. I have objects permanent issues. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm down here. Why would you look Idiot. the opposite way to where he was? <laughs> it's like right? I don't see hey, you anymore. You where are you? <laughs> it's like uh, nurse. <laughs> Nurse, I think this guy's a lot worse than he looks. <laughs> what are you doing down there? Who's ever heard of down before? <laughs> You're not going under that bed, are you? I'm drawing. Drawing? Yeah. Just gonna be completely indignant with this guy. Like, that's, that's how I'm viewing this guy now. Like, seriously. An indignant asshole right now. That's he's Honestly, doing nothing why are but you, that. Why are you even in my room? Go away. Ah yes, you're 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 the um. You know how some people have like good and bad fairies on their thing. You're you're the grumpy fairy. That's just like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Want to see? I guess I know what it's gonna be. No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm drawing it. llama worms. I knew it. <laughs> See? <laughs> Wait, what? That's not Too much math. Oops, That's math. Wrong side. <laughs> Brandon. Oh, I mean, let's see. Has he been going okay though? I can't see this one, but I'm guessing it's eight by eight, and then nine by four, thirty-six. Yeah, five by two. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you're going a little slow there, Brandon, but so far, so good. 
We even draw a dog. Yeah. Obviously, drawing a dog in the corner will give you bonus points. So, good job so far. Yeah. Keep going, Get Brandon. Good, Whoa. <laughs> it's like we can see our <laughs> two different sides of looking at the life. <laughs> <laughs> Figure it out already. <laughs> That's my math homework. Well, I see why he's in, in hospital. It's something to do with his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was just, like, terminally stupid. I Here's mean... the llama worm. It's beautiful. Llama worm. <laughs> I love don't, it. Uh, don't worry. I knew this was going to be what we saw. Damn it. Oh, it is very cute. <laughs> is, is that his name? No, it's his species. Idiot. It'd be more funny if he's like, no, it's his species. His sub and his sub subspecies is <laughs> he's part of the family of the play. <laughs> he's got a Latin a Latin scientific name for it. <laughs> exactly, exactly. His name is Oh, that's you, sorry. Hmm. His name is What's your uh, name? Me? Uh, Kevin. Kevin. <laughs> no, I mean, M Mr. Saito. His name is... Mr. Saito. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Oh, now they're, now they're besties. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> He's so over it. That's <laughs> interesting. Oh, now what are you doing? I'm drawing. Okay, of course. Why did you even did you ask, Mr. Saito? Look over his shoulder and see what he's doing. He's right there. I know. Oh, he really does have object permanence issues. Just saying. Mr. Saito is a salary man, and he has lots of stripes. Whoa, he must be very important. <laughs> okay, done. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, where are the stripes? Oh, they're like the darker <laughs> colored bands. <laughs> yep. They're all named Saito? Yeah, it's a common name. <laughs> An answer. <laughs> this kid is such an asshole. <laughs> on accident. I know. I mean, or on purpose. How do they tell each other apart? Well, they just know. <laughs> but some of them have nicknames. Nicknames? Seriously. You don't know what a nickname is? <laughs> Come on. Sai. This guy better. had friends. I don't know. I hope we'll find out more. I'm assuming we'll find out a lot more about this man's life. Yeah. Unless it's like a one-act play just in this hospital room. Right. And then we never hear from these people again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> white. <laughs> like, this Saito is a little whiter, so his nickname is White Toe. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yep. Brilliant nickname. Very Everyone loves Waito. He's so calm. I can tell. Looks He's a happy look guy. Look on his face. Yeah. So Go pleasant. Waito. Hmm. I'd be friends when with everyone's... Waito. <laughs> right? <laughs> so cuddly. <laughs> when everyone's doing business and getting stressed, he calms them down. Uh, I like Waito. See, everyone likes oh, Waito. A positive reaction. That's nice. I know. This is the first one we've had the whole time. Yeah, he's the best. <laughs> okay, Mr. Saito, I gotta go now. But but what about the other two's name, the nicknames? Irrelevant. These bracelets won't sell themselves. Honestly. <laughs> you can't you just said to... time is money. <laughs> I get that, but he should have also doubled down on selling the bracelets, right? Like, he might still. He might still when I press enter. What I'm saying is, though, I appreciate the hustle. If that was the longest 
um, friendship bracelet sales pitch in like gaming history. I mean, probably already is, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> Very specific. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, that was just the longest wind up to a bloody friendship sale. I would be so impressed. I hope you feel better soon. Did you at least leave the picture? See ya. <laughs> okay. That was an interaction. It was indeed. Our Q3 reports show a steady decline in product efficacy. <clears throat> this is, as you know, unacceptable. <laughs> I want you all to ask yourselves... Do we have a subscriber-defined game plan for monitoring emerging technologies? What is Do we yelling? have a proactive strategy for managing finance-driven infomediaries? Are we optimized for the cloud? <laughs> On that note, I'll turn things over to Saito for his very important presentation. Saito? Ah, Saito! Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm a worms everywhere. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Saito! Pasto! <laughs> Saito, what are you doing? I, I, uh. You can't be underground right now! You have a presentation to give! Y yes, sir, uh, I, uh... Oh, everyone, pay attention! Y yes, yes, sir, yes, sir. You can say synergy. Synergy. Perfect. <laughs> Done. <laughs> they happened so quickly, I couldn't, I couldn't pause it, so... Very good. I'm sorry, sir. I uh, I seem to have forgotten my notes for the presentation at home. Idiot. I see. In that case, I'll give you one more day to prepare. Hmm. Uh, th thank you, sir. I I'll not let you down. Hey, there's wide toe. Everyone likes wide toe. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Saito! Yes, sir? I, I would like you to help me with something. Do you see that stack of papers in front of Shaito? Hi. Uh, yes? Those are metrics. They are numbers that are important. Very important. We can't make any decisions without them ever. Not even obvious ones like where to go for brunch or if Subway is better than Taco Bell. <laughs> Let me ask you two, you two something. Are you, are trains cool? <laughs> what? Yeah, yes. I agree, trains are cool. Yes? Wrong answer. Whoa. Uh-oh. Oh no. At least we're establishing right now this is the evil guy in the story. Doesn't like trains? Oh, I couldn't tell from his eyebrows. No, not at all. The answer is we don't know. We don't know of anything unless the metrics tell us so. Don't assume <laughs> anything without the numbers. Okay. <laughs> that face. <laughs> Poor Saito. He's not cut out for this corporate world. He really isn't. He really isn't. That's why seven. I need you to bring me seven metrics, specifically. Seven units of metrics. <laughs> Let me ask you something. Is Saito a good name? I like the name Saito. Wrong answer! We can't know something like this without metrics! Jesus. <laughs> oh. Okay, next question is for both of you. Oh my gosh, don't ask me. Are metrics good? Uh, uh, uh. 
<laughs> if I say yes, he's going to say wrong answer. If I say no... No, you just say you don't know. God, seriously, it's not that hard of a thing. He's not some rocket science scientist here. I haven't seen the metrics on metrics yet. Exactly. I mean, I've just never known anyone who loves metrics this much. Time's up. You failed. Oh. I didn't get a chance to bring me seven metrics. Okay, then it's settled. Find me seven metrics from around the floor. Then bring them back to me at my desk. Your desk? My desk. Right outside this conference room. You know this. <laughs> Did you have too much mud last night? I thought you could handle it. Ho 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 ho. I'll go collect those now. Have a long day. <laughs> you as well, sir. But there's metrics there as well. Can I? Oh. Hello, plant. A healthy indoor plant. Hello, plant. Some metrics on that desk right there. A confident indoor plant. Woo. This garbage doesn't sell as bad as it does. Okay, so we're going to talk to these people. Oh god, and yes, there are some metrics there. So we should probably forget the metrics. Yeah. I collected the metrics. Collected wow. The metrics. I feel so... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Saito Corpse makes buttons. That's really useful. Yeah, thank you. Good to know. Wide toe, are you there? Hey, man! Hey, Aww. what's up, Saito man? You're crazy! <laughs> Standing up in front of everyone, then saying nothing, then going underground? <laughs> that takes real inner length. D don't remind me. Ah, oh, man, don't worry, man. It'll be alright, man. The, the boss gave you an extension. Your presentation is really cool. Hey, everyone's gonna love it. Uh... Anyways, have a long day, Saito man. Y you too. Wow, everyone likes everyone likes um, Vito. <laughs> <laughs> Several restaurants to have to open. Each one is onto a different restaurant's menu. Wait, can I also Wide look at this like guy's? No. I mean, how else did he become a wide tail? I suppose. Look, we got to mm -hmm. talk to each and every one of these people, of course. Right, yeah. You've got to be social. It's overwhelming. <laughs> You're smart and, uh, and your ideas are great, but uh, you stand out too much. It looks pretty normal. <laughs> <laughs> He's ironically the one who looks the most normal of all of them. Right. Everyone else has at least tried to make something different about themselves. <laughs> Saito here is just like Okay <laughs> Yeah Just like a normal dude Yeah This is my computer Welcome to Saito Mail You have two messages 32 we're step verification <laughs> We're now requiring everyone to use 32 step verification Don't forget Honestly that just seems like good security sets Seems a bit excessive Nah Read donuts you're so right. Donuts are delicious. Let's always eat them all the time. Oops, wrong voice. No idea. Hey, you are so right. Donuts are delicious. Let's start to eat them all the time. I don't know. I need to see the metrics on donuts before I can form an opinion. Wow, there you go. You're you're getting there. You're getting places. This is fantastic. I can work with Saito Corp. Yeah. Exactly. Saito have sacrificed a lot in order to rebuild and maintain underground. Yes. Oh, hi, plant. An indecisive indoor plant. Oh. Look, it's very important we say hello to all the plants. Actually, I feel like that person is probably... These people are probably important. They're saying this one, but... So I'm going to talk to everyone else first. Yeah, they look different. I don't... Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> also... You're going to get yelled at if you talk to Boss Toe. Yeah, but... He's there. He's a person. Mm -hmm. I can talk to him. Spill his coffee. Can I help you? <clears throat> what do I need to do again? <laughs> I need you to bring me seven metrics! <laughs> I only Tell said it like seven times. Tell me about Cytocorp. Cytocorp makes buttons that are used to control the tunnels in the underground. 
Tunnels yeah. are the very backbone of our society. It's how we Saitos and the other cave creatures get around. Say business things. The returns on investment factor can be summed up in one word. 24-7-365. Okay. A self-conscious indoor plant. Honestly. Oh, don't stare at it too much. Yeah, sorry, you're right. <laughs> I'm making a spreadsheet to organize my pie charts about bar graphs. Sorry, he's, wow. making, he's, he's making a spreadsheet. I love making spreadsheets. I had to. I had to take that one. You can do the next two. It's fine. I don't care. Oh. Sorry, I can't talk. I'm waiting for a phone call. <laughs> I don't <laughs> like this guy. I don't want to talk to him. What did he do? I don't know. Oh my gosh, what are you doing walking around? You're going to get us in trouble. This is the one who sent us an amazing email about 32-step verification. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't have time to talk. I'm several days behind as it is. My numbers. Yeah, but can I talk to you about other things? It's safe. Good retirement plan. But you belong to them and will work constantly. We have to, after all. Oh, God. We Saitos make the world go round. Oh, God. Oh, with the glasses glare. <laughs> yeah. So about today's meeting. Sometimes I just don't understand you. Yeah. You worked your whole life to get here. You graduated from Saito University. Can you just imagine what that would mean? Like, Saito is their species. Not only do they have their name, Saito, and a lot of people apparently just go by Saito, but then they also have a university just called Saito University. It's like having yes. a university called Human University. You studied many long years at Human University. And then all the humans were also named human. Yeah, exactly. Hi, human. How are you? Or boss man or odd man. I, I would yeah, I would unfortunately be a wide man. <laughs> Ouch. Why do you keep pulling stunts like this? You have the potential to be promoted. Ah, uh, yes. Let's consistently f strive for that promotion that will never come. Ouch. It feels too real. <laughs> but if you keep going down this path... On it, that's apparently why Para didn't want to play with me for this one. She, she was like... Oh. It's t it sounds like it'll hit too close to home. I'm like, okay, fair. <laughs> Corporate reality. I know, right? <laughs> it's fair. fair. You're gonna end up like sub parto over there. Oh no. That idiot. <laughs> it just give him menial tasks to keep him busy, but he'll never be promoted. I mean, but he'll probably be more happy in in like his work-life balance, right? I reckon we'll talk to this guy and he'll be really well adjusted. Uh, we'll see. Do you want to end up like that? Just walks odd. away. <laughs> odd toe is odd. This computer is old. Yeah. Saito pipes? I haven't seen this game in a decade. Well, then you should... We're gonna play a game within a game. And maybe you should look at the, the little the picture here and see who's actually at this desk. Because clearly you should be friends with them. Mm -hmm, mm hmm You should get those metrics. I should get those metrics. Whoa. Did we talk to this oh. plant? I forget. No, we oh, not. it's fabulous. It is fabulous. All right. Ahem. I've heard you're a good guy. Outside to a corpse buttons, the tunnels we all travel through wouldn't work properly. Oh, I was kind of hoping that you'd actually have your name and that... And who else was he talking about? Maybe this is meant to be... Maybe there is actually meant to be someone here, but they're currently over here. And they're expecting me to go talk to this button person beforehand. And then I'll be back there later. I don't know. Um, sorry guys, you just look too important. I'm being <laughs> punished. I've been temporarily demoted for making sure Sapporo presses this button. Oh, there's Sapporo. It was Sapporo. There's Sapporo. Subparto. Sub, sorry. Uh, why? What did you do? Well, uh, 
I spent all night formatting this spreadsheet, you see? I only have some doofer dumpers come along and merge all 2,000 cells into a single cell. Oof. You can just hit undo. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. You just go control Z, man. You know? Or I control Z. <laughs> control Z, yes. Uh, I got <laughs> so mad I uninstalled all these programs and threw his computer in the river. Ah, oh my God. I see. What was the purpose of uninstalling programs and then throwing the computer in the river? You I could mean, have skipped that first step. It depends, really. Like, a hmm. CRT screen... I don't know how waterproof it would have been, because they're all CRTs. They also appear to be... I don't know, there is definitely towers next to all of them. Hmm. It is possible, because they would have to have hard drives, not SSDs in them. That you could recover the data and thus the programs if they would mm. even if they were submerged because oh, like the hard drives have survived fires before so yeah it makes it makes perfect sense as to why you'd want to uninstall this program first cool so <laughs> glad i got this lesson <laughs> i'm now being labeled inflexible wait what <laughs> Um, I think it was I, a reaction that was the problem. Do you I've been be... assigned to this button. I had to push this button 50 times today. He looks stressed. Not, not at all happy. Let's press the button for him. As you can see, it takes a lot of effort to press that button. We are going to press that button 50 times now, right? <clears throat> What do they press buttons with? How do they type? Let's keep watching. So that was one, two, three, four, five. Okay, thanks, but I can handle it. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> I was assigned to this job because I have the specific skills required <laughs> to press this button. <laughs> 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20. You're doing it all wrong. If they wanted you to be the button presser, they would have made you the button presser. It's not wrong, but... <laughs> but they didn't. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, and 50. <laughs> what do you want, a cookie? Yes, please. Oh, actually, because it's... <laughs> <clears throat> I got an achievement for it. I'm just gonna keep pressing nice. for a little longer. Okay. I got an achievement. I don't think you need to do that anymore. Yeah, yeah. Saito Shipping Co. Something has been written on the side of the box and what looks like children's crayons. <laughs> Subparto is so smart. <laughs> oh dear. This music but is I, cute. I just replaced his entire job. And yes, um, Laura, um, it's actually got a few big names. Like, I think Toby Fox makes some of the uh, music in this one, too. Oh, whoa, Toby Fox? You don't know him, do you? No. <laughs> He's the guy who made the music for Sorry. Undertale. Ah, okay, that's cool. Yeah, a lot of it's made by... Game. A lot of it's made by Laura, Laura obviously, because, you know, Laura's amazing. Um... But mm -hmm. there's also a couple that are apparently made by um, Toby Fox, or at least one made by Toby Fox. And there's a few others which are made by other people too. But the soundtracks are always a highlight of these games. Always. Yeah, it's really fun. Yes, yes. Laura also does some really good music um, that involves singing. So mm -hmm. I, I guess we go this way. Oh. <laughs> what is that? The best thing in this universe. It's so round. It's a real borb. Oh my gosh, what is that doing here? Stay away, stay away. 
we're gonna go right towards it. I am definitely gonna go right towards it. First, we need to dress two sisters and some plants. Yeah, we gotta dress the plants. Well, this one wants us to. It's an extroverted girl plant. Oh, it's talking actually. Oh, oh. my god. <laughs> oh, hi! I'm so glad you came by! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> an introspective oh. indoor plant. Ah, I want to say hi to him. Oh man, he really doesn't like it. Ah, stay far away from that. Excuse me, but I, ah, I can't. Why do you hate them so much? Okay, well, I guess we gotta go explore some more. Oh, hello, is this okay. Wide Toe again? Say so, man! How did you beat me here? I guess you went underground. You got here just in time for cake! Ooh, I do like cake. Making me hungry. Guys, cake. This cake smells later. like. This this cake smells like bananas. This cake looks the most delicious. I know the cake seems like a lie to me. Pretty. Hmm. I wonder if I drink too much coffee. Probably. Irito's not around here, is he? Oh God. Imagine if your nickname was just based on how irritating you were. That's horrible. Right? I don't I'm think so. so. Good, I really need this break. Irito wants you to listen to him, but he doesn't care about listening to you. Wow. <laughs> that hurts. Uh, oh, that's you, sorry. That hurts. We Saitos have feelings too. <laughs> Bentos placed uh, for a place called Saito Mart. Of course. Human Mart! Oh, I don't like being on a diet. These all look so delicious. Oh, oh, I'm so happy. I've always liked meals that have tiny bites and different kinds of foods. Me yeah. too. I like tasting plates. Mm hmm. I didn't get enough sleep last night. To be fair, nor did okay. I. I woke up at uh, 4 30. Freak. A perfect triangle sandwich. My one source of happiness today. Oh man. <laughs> Can I eat it? No, I cannot eat it. <laughs> Take the happiness away from him. <laughs> <clears throat> look, look. I got like white. my one source of happiness, and then you just eat the sandwich in front of me. <laughs> I, I don't think this game would be that cruel. <laughs> Probably yeah, shouldn't ride the elevator. <clears throat> Didn't know it was an elevator, okay? Ah, we got some more plants to say hello to. Oh my god, that one's wearing a panda hat. Oh, it's neat how something like this just grows out of the ground. A demanding indoor plant. Uh oh. It knows what it wants. <laughs> we need more creative white. Oh, we need more creative whiteboarding. Boss time. <laughs> the metrics say so. It's true. The metrics do say that. Door to engineering lab. Ooh. Ooh. An indoor plant wonders if this is all life has to offer. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Hi there, friend. Jason Toe. <laughs> so now's a name. <laughs> I just finished writing a program that will help us locate more dumpus rocks. I'm going to call it Huge Dumpus. <laughs> <laughs> Why did Panda Hat Guy have to be an idiot? <laughs> you know, I think he did that on purpose, and I think he knows exactly what he did. And quite frankly, I respect him for making this job fun. I respect all the other side toes who are actually making this job interesting versus the ones that are just sitting there being mm -hmm. like, eh, Irito's the worst. Like, oh my god. <laughs> listen to me yeah <laughs> about 300 calculators computer paper with alternating beige and tan stripes nice <laughs> books about llama worm programming languages s and worm that would be like having that would be like having a programming language called man <laughs> <laughs> like i know c plus plus python and man <laughs> mm-hmm mm -hmm. 
Maybe the worm is their python. Yeah, that's fair. They don't respect snakes. Space Cytos? I love this game! Uh oh. Attention all Cytos. An unidentified Megamori has eaten 75 pounds of server cables and then promptly threw them back up again. <laughs> As a result, all the servers will be unavailable from 1900 to 2200 Saito time to allow for repair and cleaning. Apologies for any convenience. Oh shit, they gave a second person the person's boss first of choice. Didn't mean that. Kaijito, promoted by Kaito. Network admin of Saito Corp. Okay, well I guess we'll find him later. Ooh, a mush light. I want one. I want one too. So are you going to go off and play uh Where's the merch for this game? There is actually plenty of merch, yes. You can get a big plushie of the Minamori. I think. What's a Megamori? The thing out there, the bird thing. Oh, the correct answer is nothing. What's a Megamori with you? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, that's too good. What the hell? <laughs> all right, so well, this, is all all you this is now your YouTube channel. Congratulations. <laughs> This is how this is how you win a YouTube channel. You just yeah, it's just it's gonna pass the crown over to you and just like fuck off. Yeah, you got, yeah. You, got, you got about a month. No more of... space. You've got no more Whoa. space game. Oh no, no, no! <laughs> All horror games from here on out, and you still got to be the one to play them because you're still like the face of the of the channel. I just what? wrench it. What? <laughs> I don't agree with that anymore. I don't like <laughs> horror. I like space. Boring. Oh. <laughs> I was going to say, you've got about a month or so of um of backlog. I'm sure you'll be able to make your own videos fine. <laughs> yeah, I definitely have a lot of <laughs> Free games time. to play. Oh, yeah, true. That is one defining... Ooh, a button. I don't have so much free time. Just gonna keep pressing that, huh? Let me, wouldn't you? We gotta test the products. See, this is the this is the sort of high quality content people come here for. Yeah, I could watch about three hours of this for sure. <laughs> Did you know that Saito left Saito Court to start his own business? He said he wants to open up a Minamori Cafe. I wonder if he knows what he's doing. Mm, can't stand Minamori. <laughs> hey, come to think of it, didn't you say that your apartment had a Minamori in the station? <gasps> oh my god. They are things that could just... You can come home and have a Minamori in your house? <laughs> they just live there? I would love that! <gasps> just come home and sit, It's like not like a mouse or anything. It's just this massive owl just sitting there. I'd just be like... Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have to feed you, or...? Right. Yes. You're gonna press that button too, huh? I gotta press all the buttons. Hey, what happens if I need, like, a bathroom break or something? I, I, I pause. I, I pause. Am I allowed to? Yes, I pause. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'll it's... be right back. <laughs> oh, a trick. Oh. Okay, sure, I will pause. Right now we can continue. Then it's no time has passed. <laughs> <laughs> this button and I makes didn't me just angry. have a sneezing attack. <sighs> I mean, I didn't know you were dead. You didn't do it here. It's I giant... muted myself like a pro. Whoa, whoa! I'm impressed. It's a giant <laughs> dumpus rock. Those are so weird. Such a nice color. She sounds like those. <laughs> I love how that's the, the thing. He's just like, wow, there's a brand of beakers in this science lab. Better tell this guy not to drink them. Otherwise, oh boy. Yeah, those aren't for drinking. Clearly, clearly, Kili Saito's um, drinking problem is well known. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I would never do that. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Force of habit. I have to tell Subparto that about 12 times a day. Oh, God. <laughs> You just can't stop eating and drinking non-food work supplies. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he's been demoted to button pressing. And I did his job better, faster, and more directly than he did. Right. <laughs> <laughs> button research notes. Ooh. But where are the metrics? That's true. Hey, it's one of the buttons I designed. Oh. Decided. This button makes me sad. This button really makes me think. Also, before we leave. How did the other buttons make you feel? I mean, they just make me feel. Those red ones up there. We, you, we, we already spoke to those. Indifferent. Oh, I wasn't paying attention, sorry. And angry. That's probably too busy sneezing probably I, I i read them when you just came back from the break from your brief <laughs> stopover which is immediately when the sneezing started i see i see it's just, it's just one of them it's not really an infestation it's just one of them yeah exactly it's like only like a meter wide I know I would and, have no problem just having one of those sitting around my house. And if they're pests, then how to get in here and why is nobody shooting away? I mean, this is quite sizable. No one probably noticed it. Yes. But like, what <laughs> right, you, like, yeah. Nobody noticed this humongous thing just sitting there on top of a table. Exactly. Yeah, it could be like a beanbag. No. Yeah, I, well, I, would, buy a, I would buy a beanbag of him. How did you go to the engineering what's it? We went to the engineering what's it. That's where we just were. Okay. I think, I think your memory might be a little bit... Ah! There's some metrics. I forget. I don't pay attention so good. I clicked the metrics. Good job. There's some more on the bottom. I can see them. Hey, a driven engine. All I know is we have to connect, collect metrics. Exactly. Manuals How operating... Many have now? I haven't been counting, to be honest. I assume this is the last one because we can't go anywhere else. Mm. Manuals for operating llama worm fax and coffee machines. That's useful. Also. Oh. Wow. Yeah, they, they really do if that's all that's written on every single whiteboard in the town. Saito shipping go. Something just blocks with crayons. Brain? Brain. Like brain, but broin. Mm. Mm. Kind of like idiot. Sapato has good broin. Broin? broin? <laughs> this box contains paper. I'm not allowed to use this phone. Wow, really? You gonna let that stop you? <laughs> I have to make 50 copies of this bar graph and then staple them all together. Coffee machine doesn't have any paper in it. Any little plant that's won a lot of chess tournaments. Great. Wow. Yeah. Has someone been chewing on this tape? Probably Subparto, that idiot. Yeah, yeah. I, I would say so. <laughs> someone ate all the paper in this one. Probably also Subparto, gotcha. I mean, we know he was here. He <laughs> wrote freak. his bloody calling card. I collected metrics. Oh no. Not him. Not him. Irito, don't you remember? You gonna, you gonna read? I, I think I got disconnected for a bit. I think I'm oh. back now. <laughs> okay, hi, welcome back. Okay, so you can read it again? Because we didn't hear it. Oh, this is really irritating. Do you get disconnected again? Sorry, yeah. <laughs> Monetary disconnection. Uh, my internet kind of sucks. Disclaimer. Okay, fair. <laughs> it's funny it's happening right during this person. Right. Hi, guys! Uh, well, would you look at the time. Now that I've finished stapling all these bar graphs together, I've really got to run. 
I too have bar graphs. <laughs> I love the sound of my own voice. And no one else's. Oh god. He's so self-aware. <laughs> Why does this person have a job? Did did he leave? Phew! Okay, the real question is, can we get back in the meeting room? Because there was definitely some metrics on that table. I, I don't think anyone actually picked it up, so... Oh, yes. you can. More importantly, I can actually go talk to these plants. Yeah, that's very important. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, plant. <laughs> this plant has problems, but he's working on them. You'll see. Oh, I believe in you. Trains are cool, aren't they? Written by Saito Saito. <laughs> okay. okay. What's the point of a last name if you just use the same name as your first name and the same name as everyone else? Hmm. A spicy indoor plant. Ooh, that's spicy. <laughs> indoor plant has really strong opinions. Oh no. I surprised that one didn't say something. Some of them do. Yeah. These, do these golf diaries want to boss tomorrow? It's a golf diary. <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> Dear diary, today I golfed. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's just a rich person thing. We wouldn't understand. I, I golf so good. <laughs> I, I hit it right in that hole. It was so amazing. And Johto was so jealous. Oh my god, was he jealous? Yeah. <laughs> Books about llama worm business practices. <laughs> Clearly they are very metric driven. Yeah. An indoor plant that acts first and asks questions later. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Th these are my presentation notes, but... Is this pictures of donuts? <laughs> How tired must I be when putting these slides together? Wait, so you actually <laughs> did have your presentation notes here? You lied? I bet leap for everyone sees. Wait, so you you could have done the presentation. But it would have been just been donuts. Yeah, but like he acted like, oh uh, sorry, I left it at home. He was just being disingenuous. And this is how you get <laughs> demoted to getting metrics can I help you have your metrics good very good huh huh hmm. <laughs> what is it trains are cool Okay, I have one more task for you. I've just emailed you a special code you'll need to bring to the engineering lab across the lobby. Please check your computer and then bring them the code. Boss, boss Toe needs to chill. This is my computer. Welcome to Saito Mail. Bring this to the engineering cab. Do I actually have to write this down? Because I don't have Five four one seven O U. I know, but I won't remember that. Will you? Five four one seven O U. I might be able to. Okay, or I could just like take a snip of it just in case. That's there, what snipping. That's what snipping. Okay, that probably works better. Mm -hmm. You learned the special code. Okay, she says you learned it. It means it was learned. You're smart. smart and your ideas are great, but sorry, I cut you off. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you stand out. Oh, we've done this before. Yeah. yeah, I know. I just want to check if the if the um if they change at all. Yeah, you know, because yeah. I would I would talk to every single one of them again if the dialogue had changed. Yes, I believe it. <laughs> I'm sure this is how everyone wants to watch it. Oh no. <laughs> hmm. Oh no. Irito. He's level seventy. No. Level 70 pain in the ass. Yeah. All I have to do now is bring this code to the engineering level up ahead and, uh... Is that who I think it is? Uh... Spotted. It's Saito! Uh... Why are you going underground, Saito? 
Have you heard the latest wizardry, the rallying news? Uh... No? Well, you're missing out. They added an entirely new crystal. Uh... Amethyst! I bet Abby would love that. How are they going to balance that? It's so broken. I mean, think about it. They have a ruby card that lets you draw more cards. Ruby doesn't draw cards! Uh... So I was thinking about how the broken crystal sphere is a lot like... The best manga ever written. Tetsuo Wonderheart. It changed my life. Uh, I have to go. But you know what makes me really mad? <laughs> the fact that the Tetsuo Wonder Heart anime is just trash compared to the manga. Trash! How do I get out of it? this? The opposite! We <laughs> say that's interesting! I'll explain. <laughs> oh no, what have you done? <laughs> so you see... <laughs> the ratio of chapters to episodes is just outrageous if you compare it to other manga and anime. How do you get time to do work? Uh, don't worry, you can escape. Just try and remember Bosto's special code. Ah, good thing we wrote, wrote it down. Wait, did you write it down? Uh, it's not on the did. Discord anymore. Okay, sorry. Oh. Yeah, I send it. Please do send it, because I'll be the one who needs to see it. <laughs> say a number over and over again in your mind. As long as he doesn't start saying a bunch of numbers, you'll be fine. Zero four nine five two three eight zero nine five two three eight zero nine five two is fifty two divided by one hundred five. <laughs> oh my god. Boku no Hamster Castle has 52 episodes. The manga has 105 chapters. I, I, I bet Paro watched an anime called Boku no Hamster Castle. Just to say. <laughs> I would too. <laughs> I mean, honestly, me too, but still. Just under 50%. Ah, the code, the code, 541. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Zero point four five seven one four two eight five seven one four two eight five seven one is three hundred and twenty divided by seven hundred. Why okay. are you saying this stuff to me? Why is he like this? Vegetable Magi Marcus has three hundred and twenty episodes. The manga has seven hundred chapters. Oh god. Also oh. close to fifty percent. If you compare that to Tetsuo Wonderheart. Also, I didn't skip that. That just automatically happened, just for record. It's just like blasting off information. <laughs> Bust into the conversation. But I don't know what to say. Oh, come on, Saito. Uh, uh, I really like desserts where you can eat the bowl. <laughs> like where the bowl is made of chocolate. <laughs> Tetsuo likes chocolate. Uh, <laughs> you know what else I like? Dancing. Did you, Did you know, know that oh, excel at dancing because of our exceptional flexibility? Um, okay, I have to go back to work. <laughs> Look, later, Saito. Have a long day. Uh, yeah, you too. Yeah, get the heck out of here. Just had to talk about something that... Now, would the others come back out? Nope, they're just gone. They're gone forever. Gotcha. Why is that per okay? There we go. Ah, Saito, ah. did you bring it? That's you, okay. I can do it. You can do it. Ah, again. Saito, did you bring us the special code from Bosto? I did. It's hey. uh, uh, it's uh, five four one seven zero U. Great. Now we can continue with the project. Hmm. I didn't get that. Could oh. you try it? A... Oops, my Siri just went off. <laughs> Why does your Siri sound like an Indian man? Don't worry about it. <laughs> I, I I am very confused right now. Okay. 
What's up, Saito man? He hello. So, Saito man, you coming with us to Saito Iazaka for a round of mud? I need to sleep. Basto insists. Oh, I've heard this about Japanese working culture. It's really toxic. Yeah. Don't worry, buddy. I'll make sure you get home all right. There will be gossip. Because that's all we live for in life, work. So we can mm -hmm. do the work gossip. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I guess I never really have a choice when it comes to this. Come on, it'll be fun! What is this peer pressure nonsense? We'll order all the best snacks. Ooh, I assume snacks. the company's... I assume the company's gonna pay for it? I would hope so. Ah, yeah, let's go! Woo! Um, Woo! I was saying woo on my own accord, not stealing your line, just for the record. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is just saying. Okay, everyone! Socialize! <laughs> There's a little mushroom guy down there. I don't know. Are oh, they just work there? I guess so. Who do you think you are? Me? Yeah, you. Saito Shmaito. You're not the only one who works hard. I did press all your buttons for you today, though. I didn't say that, I... You're a big phony. I'm the best. You d dump. Yep, this is a really pleasant experience. Dumpus. Dumpus. <laughs> Isn't that akin to basically just calling me iron or or grounds? Because it's already been established that that dumpus is their primary mineral they get from the underground. Right. That was uncalled for. Aww. Have you heard uh, hole-in-one golf insurance? If we Saitos get a hole-in-one while golfing, we're expected to spend upwards of a year's worth of sal salary. Wait, what? what? To spend upwards of a year's worth of salary. On what? Mainly golf equipment that you give as presents to friends and colleagues. That's why if you golf a lot, you'd better have hole-in-one golf insurance. Wait, what? Why would you need to... I don't understand. I... So apparently when they get a hole-in-one in their universe... Yeah, it's like a penalty. You have yeah. to spend your, whole your salary on buying golf equipment for other people. <laughs> and you get so you have to buy an insurance policy <laughs> so that if you get a hole-in-one that doesn't happen or it pays for it. Yeah, what a horrible situation. So up to we ate all the paper in the coffee room again. I wish I could fire them. Fire him. Let's go talk to him again if he's got a second line. You're a dumpus! Gosh, take God. it easy! <laughs> you take it easy. Okay, so they've all got two? Oh, I hope that last area didn't have two, too. Hope your presentation will be ready by tomorrow morning! You know, it's, it's almost as if maybe I should be working on it right now. Because I'll be golfing with the new clients in the afternoon. Make sure you get that insurance. I think Boss Tower ordered this. These look delicious. Mm. Otto wonders what it would be like to audit a bear. Otto always speaks in third person when he drinks mud. You're an accountant, aren't you, Otto? Otto? You can be my reality show on my reality show about accountants in Alaska. What? Why was Alaska in quotes? I don't know. No. Not even if we called it Deadly as Bear Audits? <laughs> <laughs> well. <laughs> deadly as Bear Audits. It has a nice ring to it. It does, actually, yeah. Hey, have you ever heard of a faraway magical land called Alaska? <laughs> From what I've heard, it's an extreme place. Snowstorms, bears, 
Moose attacks. This is why so many extreme reality shows all take place there. They've done it all. Extreme fishing, extreme gold mining, but you know what they haven't done yet? Extreme accounting. <laughs> Damn right. One day I'll start a reality show about extreme accounting set in Alaska. Oh. I don't want to sleep at the train station again. And you should drink less mud. And Renee drink lots of mud! Oh my god. Uh, 1040s and minus 40 and tax to the limits. Ice cold CPAs. Ooh, this does smell good. Are you not eating or drinking anything tonight, Saito? Staying busy. Uh, Saitos are always so full of stress when they get here. But once they've had some of our food and mud, they start to unwind a little. That's probably a good thing. Mm. Mm, this looks like one of White Toast Cakes. One of? Mm, cake. One of? <laughs> Excuse me. Hey, Saito man! Glad you could make it. Man, poor Shaito. He's more stressed out than anyone I know. Work is important, but it's only one aspect of being in the long day club. I mean, mm. is it though? They get up and do it really early. Sometimes for a hostel, apparently. They go straight to work. Then they go straight for drinks till I assume nighttime. Like, what other element of the day is there besides work? This, for an introvert, would still be work, right? Yeah, this work life balance sucks. Yeah, it does. Long day club? You know how we, you know how we Saito say have a long day? Yeah. Well, I was thinking about why we say that, and why it's so important. Uh, to Saito, a long day is a day that's full of good things that improve our lives. Being productive, being physically active, enjoying the little things, being nice to one another, laughing and learning. All these things make us feel better, and they make us better Saitos. But sometimes we get off track, and it can be tough getting back on again. Ugh. That's why I decided we need a long day club. Where members strive for long days and help other members do the same. That sounds like a good club. Hey, then you're a member! Ah. Have some cake if you want. You, you want cake here? Well, yeah, cake's on the, on the menu. Oh. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Shaito. Shaito. He's always standing in the corner of these things. I understand. I don't want to be here. Why are we even here when there's still so much work left that they expect us to do this week? Or you could go home and have a nice evening. Because Bosto insists. I'm not. Oh, that's you. I'm not good enough. I can't contribute enough. I'm so tired all the time. Uh, I know how you feel. Hey, Shaito man, it's okay! No, no, it's not okay. I, I can't do this anymore. Oh no. Oh no. There's too much pressure. I don't want to do this anymore. Me every day at work. <laughs> oh no. One of these days, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna dig to the center of the world! Whoa there, Shaito man! That was some good timing on stopping the music there, but, uh... <laughs> you don't want to do that! A Saito can never come back when he digs to the center of the world! Wait, is that literally their version of, uh, unaliving like themselves? Sounds like it. Oh god. It's they're jumping off a bridge. <laughs> it's too much pressure, White Toe. I'm not like you. I can't handle it. Then eat more cake. <laughs> yes, you can, Shaito Man. Things are always feel worse when you're in the middle of a storm. But even a big storm can't last forever. I mean, if you haven't reached the eye yet, it might be a while though. Right, Saito Man? 
Waito is kind of wise. Right. Waito, I'm more like Waito. Right. <laughs> exactly. Shaito, man, you'll come back from this. Okay, you're right. I, I'm sorry for... So what is it with people who are like, instead of, I'm going to quit my job and find something new. They're like, <laughs> like I'm, I'm going to end it myself. all. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is like a very extreme leap in logic there. What a vibe. Huh. It's all good, man. You just make sure to get enough rest tonight. Thank you. about that. I think I've had too much mud tonight. I don't think I've had any mud. Yeah, you gotta get sloshed on some mud. Yeah, apparently so. Can I, can I leave now? I'm very good at golf. Though I'll tell you one thing I've yet to do. I've never gotten the hole in one. Cheap ass. <laughs> hey, you leaving now, Saito? Wait up, I'll walk with you. Okay, so you, you can't just leave whenever you want. Even if the boss insists. Mm, mm, mm. You're gonna be okay if you hear from Sato, man? I'll be good. Okay, then. See you later, little buddy. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, don't forget don't forget your presentation notes for tomorrow. I won't. <laughs> just I'll make more donuts. donuts. Oh, uh, you live right next door. Apparently so. Um. Huh. Uh. Is there like what? a hole under this bed? And he just like. I, I try not and... to think too much about the whole situation because it's. It's, it's not really. Lot. Right now, it's a whole lot to think about. <laughs> a whole lot. A yeah. whole lot. Ah, uh, so tired. Okay. All the time. I'm surprised he even has a chance to do his laundry, to be honest. Right. Oof. So this is... Oh! No! <laughs> ah! So many. Aww. Ah! That. Are you okay? Uh, how? I heard screaming. Why were you in my la la laundry? How'd you get in my apartment? You have a really bad Mini Mori problem here. I don't see it as a problem, per se. I mean, this is really, really. Well, why are you in my apartment? I'm Brandon. Yeah. Have you ever heard of the flooded gemstone caverns? No. I've wanted to go there my whole life. The caverns are beautiful. It's officially my dream place to go. That's great. Here you go again. I finally set out to find it yesterday. My map says you gotta go to this room that has three doors. The middle door leads to the caverns. When I got to the room with the three doors, they were all locked. I can't go back now. I've come so far. There's gotta be some way in. <laughs> Will you help me, Mr... Mr... Saito. Will you help me, Mr. Saito? Uh, what? No, I have to go to work. Can't you get your parents to take you or something? Grandma's working right now, so I wouldn't want to bother her. You little bastard. I <laughs> just said I was working. <laughs> but I'm going to tell her all about it. Uh, look, I'm sorry, I can't help you. I have to give a very important presentation at 8am, so I really need to get going. It's 10.30. Well, what? Oh my gosh, Wasto is going to be furious with me. Aww. I'm 
reading it. It, it just they just missed the W. So. Oh yeah. Uh, going Aww. off script. No, no, no. I'm just adding. I'm the only thing I'm doing is adding a single W. The expression Aww. on on Saito's face does not elicit that same emotion. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if you ever see me go, ah. I can open up my mouth more when I'm going, ah. Yeah, it's the same like mouth shape, but it's not the same. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Saito? <sighs> You're so cute, I just got overwhelmed. <laughs> Mr. Saito, what's the matter? Minamori. So cute. Are you afraid of the Minamori? Uh, no. I love them all. Well, you know, I could help you. How? You could? Of course. I'll clear this place out in no time. Okay. You can just stay underground and close your eyes. No, I really want to have my eyes open for this. Close your eyes. I want to know. I'll let you know when it's safe to come out. I want to know what he does. Okay. Oh, we, we don't see it. That's what I was saying. Are you okay up there? Very okay. You can come out now. Oh god, I hope he's just like put hats and a, and a scarf on them or something. They're gone. <sighs> They're all gone. H how did you do it? I'm a Minamori Whisperer. What? Is that the equivalent of being like a, a rat whisperer and just being like, Hi rats, <laughs> how, how are you going? Can you leave this house? Pigeon Whisperer. Whoa, 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 Well, that's whoa, what grandma whoa. Would be anyway. Pigeons are great. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. That's so weird. Okay, I hope you have a good day at work. I was so close to finally seeing the flooded gemstone caverns, but I guess it just wasn't meant to be. At least I can imagine what it might have been like. Bye, Mr. Saito. Uh, wait. Did we ever cover, like, how this guy got in here to begin with? <laughs> just, like, broke no. into his apartment. No, we did not. He, he clearly came out of the washing bag, though, when he first jumped down, so... Yeah. I guess since I already missed my presentation, and since you helped me get rid of all the memory... And a Megamori! I suppose I could take you with you onto your gem caverns. You will? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you so much! Wow. He's so... happy. We should start by going to the Saito train station beneath here. Is this kidnapping? Like reverse <laughs> kidnapping? Like a kid I don't, I mean, with consent. I guess. We can get to the room on my map from there. Oh, what have I gotten myself into? But first... <laughs> first we need to check everything in the room, see if there's any more info. Mm -hmm. I, I think this is kind of voices. like... Like what happened when I agreed to, to do this video game with you? It's the same thing. Oh. Oh, I see. <laughs> but, but aren't you, you asked, having... I said, yes. <laughs> but, but aren't you having fun? Yeah, it's a fun game. I like it. I love clean laundry. It smelled really good when I was in there. Why were you hiding in my laundry? Did you know that bears have a high IQ? Well, I appreciate the bear facts, you know. Yeah, bear facts. Also, this looks like it could be another room. Oh, it is! Oh, good, you have a kitchen. What a nice place. Yeah, it's lovely. Oh, we gotta fill the sink with water and then drain it. Oh, we could drain it, yeah. Looks like it's a rice cooker. It's a tag on the side. Read it. It can also be used to steam dirt. Okay, fine, oh, I'll drain it. And fill it back up again. Okay. Okay. And then drain it again. You turn on the really? stove. I want to eat all the candy at once. Oh, that's a lot of candy, Mr. Saito. Are you going to eat it all at once? Yes. 
could if you wanted to. You're a grown up. I know. <laughs> I try to eat a sensible breakfast when I can. Was that breakfast just already made? Because like you just woke up and was I you assume been sitting it's... there for days. Yeah, probably. What's worse is you've seen it for days and just an leave untouched. <laughs> just an egg, yeah. yeah. Just a cooked egg sitting there, a cup of very cold coffee, and what appears to be, I don't know, maybe cereal or... Some kind of porridge? Yeah. There's also appears to be two sausages on the plate. For some reason they're like in a line. And something green. What green thing would go with that? I think it's just for decoration. Some, like a parsley sprig or something. Yeah, that's fair. That's that. fair. Yeah, I, I, I should just trust your ability. Ooh, hi. What's that? Friendly Sorry, foot. folks. This area is closed for renovations. Okay. Oh. Yeah, of course, we need to go to the bar. You can just oh, no, walk into is, people's houses. This is Wide Toe's house, apparently. Yeah. Long day club. Aw. Aw. This must be Wide Toe's club. He said I could be a member, so I'm going to take this. This cake turned out nicely. There's just cake everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> it's cake on the floor. 50 of the <laughs> world's deadliest cakes. <laughs> Why? A cake on the floor kind of guy, right? That's, that's interesting. I wonder what kind of shows this guy watches. He's talked a lot about a show where bears fight cakes. <laughs> it's all bears and cakes. Oh, I love bears versus cakes. The cake has only ever won once. I'm. I want to. I want to see that episode. <laughs> How did the cake win against the bear? I look also, at the little rubber duck. I do love the duck poster. Yes. Go to the patio. I cannot go to the patio. Dang. Oh wow! What? Oh, something other than cake. I know. It looks healthy. Extreme Sudoku. 1,000 puzzles that will blow your mind. I better look away then. <laughs> oh no. This cake smells like bananas. Oh, another tag on the side. Okay, so it's uh, the same same brand it, as ours, clearly. Yeah. We gotta fill the sink with water. I mean, yeah, it's, it's needed. Those flowers look like my cousins. And you just got pictures of them in the house. A little bit creepy. Weird. Alright, so the real question is, if this is Wide Toe's house, who's over here? Can you just watch it? Oh, you can't just walk in. Okay, that's good. Do you know the people who live here, or do you just like knocking on doors? <laughs> the big thing okay. is, then, does that, imply that, does that imply that I've got Wide Toe's key? I think maybe he just leaves his doors unlocked. He's just like a trustworthy, like a trusting guy, you know? Yeah, but if I found out there was a house that was always full of cake... Mm. And it's something with hot and cold drinks. Really? Wait, more importantly, it's a bunch of crumpets for free? It's my favorite food. You look really happy, Mr. Saito. Happy and hungry. Are you going to eat one? Oh, no, I shouldn't. Why not? I'm on diet. But we're going on an adventure. You need energy for that. It's true. Well, maybe later. It's so fluffy. Complimentary coffee. Wow, this is a great place. Like, yeah, what a fantastic is. apartment. I don't get... I don't get... I never have been in an apartment where I get free cakes. The bonsai doesn't talk. Oh, yeah, true. God, you're right. Fuck. We almost the missed the plant. No over there. Sorry, we, al we almost missed it. Ah. Oh, and he was devastatingly, devastatingly handsome. Wow. God, oh, thank you. I almost missed that. I yeah. It's key. Very, very key component to the gameplay. Mm -hmm. what? Yeah, that's a good point. Can I talk to Bonsai as well? I love little Aww. trees. Okay, gotta yeah, keep that in mind. Gotta talk to everything and everything around. Also, more importantly, I love this song. It's really nice and catchy. Good song. Mm. Oh, hello. There's a train station, so let's go everywhere else but the train station. 
Saito sexories. Oh god. Accessories. Not sexories. Accessory for, <laughs> for sharp Saitos. Let's see the clothes right now. Aww. What's this one? Panky's Bakery. Fresh, wholesome baked goods made from scratch. Why doesn't wide toe work there? Right. Yeah, instead of like just ditch the corporate gig and work in a yeah. bakery if you like making cakes. Exactly. Exactly. People will pay you for your love of cakes. Exactly. This place is the public on Tuesdays. I think that's the day they make and deliver baked goods to retail stores. Mm, retail store baked goods. But you can come right to the source and get. Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna judge. You can do what you want. You've got bad taste, man. I'm not judging. Are any of these stores gonna be open? Hello, friends! <gasps> oh, it's a convenience store? Yeah, it is a convenience store. Welcome oh. to Psycho Mart! I feel very welcomed. Ah, I love this soda. It comes with a glass marble. Ooh. Not for eating. I can't wait to eat that marble. These supplies remind me of work. <laughs> I think Sir Potoro bought and ate all the glue. I'm not buying more. Convenient supplies. Supplies are convenient. <laughs> I'm not interested in this. Notebooks, long day planners, and office supplies. And some frozen treats. These Saito shaped frozen cakes are very popular right now. I want Ooh, one. Ooh, matcha chocolate chip ice cream in Saito cone. Saito brand curry is pretty good, but it's a little bit too much sodium. Oh, God. Saito brand instant noodles were developed by Saito. Okay. Shimzy soda, made with love and spores. I'm not interested in this. Ooh, in into cave candy bars. Oh, the ones with dumpers cacao are really good. Do you like Saito sticks? You know those corn chips that have stripes like llama worms? Or do you find them offensive? What? No, why would I find them offensive? Okay, good. I just wanted to make sure. Because I love corn. Who doesn't? <laughs> it's corn. <laughs> yes. We've already been welcomed. Can I interest you in today's sale item? Hand sanitizer wipes are 50% off. I do want them. Do you have to buy them with money? <laughs> well, yes. That's too bad. Unless you happen to have any decaying hunks of tree tree trunk chunks. I'd certainly trade for that. But we don't usually see those around here. Noted. Aww. Okay. Apparently we will have to find decaying hunks of tree chunks. Tree chunks. <laughs> Llama main five. The energy for over a thousand Saitos. That's a lot of energy. That is a lot of Saitos. Well, they have a public um, thingy. Ooh. I wouldn't go in there if I were you. The storage room is a bit infested right <gasps> now. You know, with the Minimori migration and all. They're everywhere. Oops, no turning back now. We already opened the door. <laughs> Wait, no, we can turn back. No, too late. Hmm, it's really dark. There's got to be a light switch around here somewhere. Uh, Brandon, where are you going? Oof. Oh, wait, I think I found it. Oh, my God. Aww. <laughs> I love them. Oh, there's some big boys. It's okay, Aww. Mr. Saito. The mini Mori migration is normal and natural. It's true. It's true. It is. Also, if these are called Mega Moris, then what are these things called? Because they're even bigger. Super Mega Moris. Nice. They always come through here this time of year. 
Tommy. The more you ate, it's natural. <laughs> <That's> not... <laughs> <Tommy. laughs> Whoa, would you look at the size of that minimum? Brandon, we're getting out of here right now. Okay. Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 Minimori 8. Minimori 8. Phew. But you got an achievement. Yes, I did. Minimori Great. migration. I did. Love that for you. <laughs> I told you not to go in there. Yeah. I'm sorry, Mr. Saito. Yeah, it's okay. Let's just get back on track. Yeah, thank you. Like going back to these. Why is half and half so good? Well, half of it is. And it's not with cold beverages. Saito Mark Bentos. Healthy meals on the go for a busy Saito. I like being on diet. Ooh, there's many different kinds of cans of coffee. We source only the purest tea and dirt to create our beverages. Only the finest dirt. Mmm. I mean, isn't that what was in your tea earlier? The finest dirt? No. Oh. The Midnight Tea no. Shop has some pretty good bottled teas. Saito Sweat. It's a weird name for a sports drink. Gross. <laughs> Ew. Like, oh my god. <laughs> Today only. Oh, we've done this already. But yeah, but it's still, still a separate line. You didn't do it with him. Mm. He's just doing a good job at spooking. My map says the gemstone caverns are behind that middle door up ahead. Oh, I thought we were literally going in the train station. Okay. Yeah, it's just like a whole other thing. I like the Minamori statue. A pedestal of a Minamori shaped line. Wait, where's the Minamori statue? Down bottom left. Oh, yes. Oh. That's very cute. Yes. Yeah. Aww. This guy okay. with the hat. <laughs> it's got a big Minamori face on it. <laughs> that means we're going to see a lot more Minamoris. <laughs> I know, it's great. Hmm, looks like some sort of ancient language. I definitely can't read this. If only there was someone who could help us, but nope. So, Indiana Jones. Okay, yeah, we'll talk to you. <laughs> uh, why, hello there, friends. I was expecting some customers so soon. Are you a donut salesman? No, not only. I do that on the side. I'm an archaeologist. You're so handsome. Oh. You can call me Archaeologitor. <laughs> Archaeoloto. Archaeoloto. Okay, sorry. Thank you for doing that. I didn't even say my own name right. Archaeoloto. Archaeoloto. Settled. <laughs> I used to work for Cytocorp many years ago, but I left to study the secrets of ancient world. Oh. Secrets. My passion is researching Minamori. <laughs> Making that face when I say Minamori is a very common reaction for a sight. I'm making a face? <laughs> yes, that face. And therein lies my biggest goal. To show the rest of the Saito world that Minamori aren't pests. They're brilliant, beautiful beings full of mystery and wonder. I see. You know... They say that Minamori have the transformative power. Spend enough time with them and you'll learn more about yourself, about life, about inner strength and inner strength, inner length and inner strength. <laughs> we need a place where Saitos and Minamoris can all hang out together. And that's why I purchased this plot of land. I'm going to start a Minamori cafe. That's a great idea. That's a terrible idea. The only problem is that I need more Minamori. I specifically chose this plot. If you look around, you'll see there's an odd min old Minamori meeting ground. Oh. Yeah, that implies they are a lot more intelligence than quote-unquote pets. 
that alone should be enough to make people not realize they're pests. Otherwise, are you just expecting this, like, other intelligent species to be kids with, like, a subspecies for you? No. The only problem is no Minamori are meeting here. Anyways, what brings you two here? We're on an adventure. I'm looking for the flooded gemstone caverns. It's been my lifelong dream to go there. What are you, like, eight? Yeah, lifelong. <laughs> lifelong. lifelong my map dream. says it's behind that middle door up there, but all the doors are locked. Hmm, locked, you say? Well, I don't have a key that opens the middle door, but I do have a key that opens the door on the right. <gasps> I'll tell you what, let's help each other out. I'll give you this key, and you can use it to explore. Legend has it, if enough live Minamori sit upon the meeting stones, a path will be opened. Maybe, just maybe, if you bring enough live Minamori to sit upon these pedestals, a path to the Crystal Caverns will open. Ah! Now, this guy really chose literally the worst possible helper for this job. Please, perfect. I'll Perfect stop time. my Minamori Cafe right here. Oh, I have so many plans. How are we supposed to bring live Minamori here? That's a good question. I could do it. I'm a Minamori Whisperer. Should we try and talk to the Minamori we found at Saito Mart? That's definitely what I was thinking. Ugh. No, those guys were migrators, so they'll be gone by now. Oh, that didn't take long. But no worries. I bet there'll be plenty of them inside this cave system. Well then, I guess you're all set. Here's a key to get you started on your quest. Ooh. Yeah. Free key. Archaeolito's key. I'm excited about that. I want a key to that chest, though. Give me that. I assume we'll get it eventually. At the moment, I we have a key to so. this door. <laughs> Are those golf balls? Has someone been playing golf in here? Okay. We've got okay. choices to make here. Oh, yeah, I know. The question is we need to find our way through first. And... The golf balls are in the way. Yeah, we I see to, the, like, way. Out of the way. I know, I know. I was thinking which way we'd actually be able to do it. Like, if I do that and that. <laughs> and... That. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That and that. Nice. Wow, you're a genius. Extreme puzzle solving. Wow, <laughs> Mr. Saito, you're so good at golf. <laughs> That's yeah. what golf is. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it is, and I am. Thank you. Make sure to put that in your golf diary. I will, obviously. You know I keep that thing up to date. <laughs> yeah, it's super important. Mm, it is, it is. Hippity hoppity. Um. Oh no. Uh uh. Uh. Okay, okay, it's okay. okay. Assume we can only jump one at a time. So, I guess we can't jump diagonally, which means I need to find the. Oh, we need to jump up here straight away? Yeah, okay, sorry. That's good. I was overthinking okay. that. Probably. I was overthinking that. We're on an adventure! Uh, just be careful over there. Yes, Mr. Saito. After all, you wouldn't want a grandmother pressing charges. <laughs> um, let me get. There we go. I was gonna say. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Ippity hoppity, let's go. The love frogs. Whoa, there's a lot of mini Mori here. Huh? Wait. Don't worry, Mr. Saito. They're not real. Phew! They're made of stone. I guess these aren't the right Minamori. How come? Archaeolito said if enough live if enough live Minamori sit upon the meeting stones. These are definitely not live. Aw. Wait. This must be some kind of a puzzle. I love puzzles! Are you okay with picking up stone, Minamori? Mr. Saito? I suppose so. Alright, first of all. 
Let's say we pull it towards the ground. Can you pick it up? Can you pick it up? Okay, it feels like it's the ground some way. Okay. We have a locked chest. Alright. We've got a bunch of things here. Two, one, etc. Okay, we have a calculator. <laughs> Llama worm. It is I, undefined. <gasps> I am communicating to you across the void through mathematics. How dare you? Wait, is this a calculator? Oh, oh, ask him if he knows anything about this puzzle. This puzzle? I made this puzzle. And you're in luck. I literally just finished wiring everything together so you can pick up those stone minamori now. What if we get stuck? Are you already asking for a hint before the puzzle has even begun? <laughs> that face. <laughs> it's really not a difficult puzzle. I'd like a hint. Okay, fine. I'm getting us a hit, Mr. Saito. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Here is your hint. This cave is a bit strange, don't you think? Perhaps that is why the Minamori gather here. They're drawn to odd things. Okay. Is that the hint? <laughs> odd yes, numbers? Yes, that's the hint. Odd numbers. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Thank God we got that hint. <laughs> yeah, because otherwise we really couldn't do much. I assume it would like... Ooh, let me keep... Progress! Hmm. Hey, Mr. Saito, what's your job? I work at Saito Corp making buttons for underground tunnel systems. I see. Yeah, we haven't actually seen any buttons yet. Are you afraid of your boss? Why would you ask that? He just seemed really worried earlier. Oh, I... Well, uh... I'm not so much afraid of my boss. It's more I don't want to let everyone down. We all have to do our part, and if I come up short, then someone else has to pick up my slack. Like yesterday, where I pressed those 50 buttons. Oh, awesome. <laughs> mm -hmm. Anyway, let's go see if this key opens. Okay. Okay. Hi there, calculator friend. I, the thing is, without that hint, like, I would just seem to do it randomly, which, like, I think the hint was kind of required for the puzzle. Mm-hmm. So, like... Okay. Mm -hmm. Ooh. <gasps> Look, Mr. Saito, it's a mini Mori. Aww. Go shake it. Hello, friend. friend would you like to come with us to sit on a stone <laughs> are they supposed to talk back usually why isn't this one responding to you i think these minamori speak a different language or something i don't know if my minamori whispering ability will work just pick it up and grab it oh i know you could carry him. Yeah, easy. Are, are you kidding me? No, I most certainly could not. So where's your arms? You're a strong llama worm, and I can tell you he's going to let you pick him up. He likes you. Aww. <laughs> Stop changing. <laughs> He's just Mr. so happy Saito? he went underground. Mr. Saito, are you okay? M Minamori. Oh, that's right. You're afraid of Minamori. I'm sorry. It's okay. Well, I guess there's not much we can do then. We gave it our best shot, and that's what matters. To be honest, I probably don't deserve to see the gemstone caverns after what I did. Oh god, what? 
what did you do? <laughs> Murdered his grandmother. You see, Morzor told me that I needed to stay in my cave for a while. But I disobeyed him. I snuck out. I really tried to stay where I was supposed to be. I tried really hard. But so much time had gone by and I just got to thinking. Maybe at this rate I'll live my whole life and never see the flooded gemstone caverns. Oh no. Why did Mori Zora want you to stay in your cave? Some parts of me just don't work right on the inside. You know how it is. What's wrong with oh. you? So I thought... Maybe I could sneak out, just this once. I'd be back in time for dinner, back before Grandma missed me. Oh well. I'm sure I could find some nice books about the caverns that I've never read before. Oh. God, this guy is re this, this thing's really <laughs> good at, like, emotional blackmail. Right, yeah. I guess I don't deserve this. <laughs> yeah! Mr. Saito, even though we didn't hang out that long today, I still have fun. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. You're doing it, Mr. Saito! You're so amazing! <laughs> <laughs> hmm, you already found the Minamori. That's fantastic. I'm curious to see what happens when you place the Minamori on each pedestal. <gasps> Ooh. Remarkable! You placed the Minamori. And a treasure chest there open. The Minamori's just gonna chill there? Yeah, I guess so. There now. Yeah. Ooh, that's a silver key. key. Which I, I assume. Door on the left. Yeah, it kind of has mm -hmm. to be, doesn't it? It's not going to be in the middle right. door. Yeah, that one's All too right. important. That one's the last. Door is locked. Alright. Okay. Llama Worm, it is I, undefined. I am once again communicating to you across the void through mathematics. Hear me, Llama Worm. If you want to pass beyond this door, you must first think like a Minamori. What's that even supposed to mean? You don't remember my last hint? Odd numbers. Oh, God what damn hint? it, Brandon. <laughs> what, what, you practically begged me for a hint on my last puzzle. What's he talking about, Mr. Sight? <laughs> Fine. I'll give you another hint. We're getting another hint, Mr. Saito. God damn it, man. Yeah. <laughs> so embarrassing. Here is your hint. This cave is a bit strange, don't you think? Is it the same hint? Perhaps that is why the Minimori gather here. They're drawn to odd things. <laughs> you gave us that hint last time. Well, that's because it still applies. <laughs> oh. Think like a Minamori. Then, approach the door and test your theory. I shall make you a path. Okay. Ooh. Whoa. So those things correspond to those guys up there on the left. Oh yeah. So just land on the one. on the odd ones. Yes, yes. I'm a so... puzzle master. <laughs> no, not that one. We could go... I can't oh. do anything else. I gotta go. Yeah. And then Oh. Now it That's all of them. So you gotta circle that. But it it takes them off after you do that. There you go, there you, fine. Go. you did it. You it's genius. We're, we're, we're fine. Now we can approach the door. Yeah, see, Yay. we're good. We're fine. Ah! What is it? Do you know where we are? 
Literally not at all. <laughs> this is the entrance to the Kanoko Matsuri Club. Can you hear the music from inside? Uh, sort of. Little Buzz has performed here before with no holds barred. Little Buds is my favorite music artist. I see. His music really speaks to me. So you're saying that you want to go inside? Mr. Saito. You can't just go inside. You have to look sharp. Is that a requirement? Well, not technically, but you want to look sharp there. Also, it's invite only. Okay, you probably should have led with that. Have led with that, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so unless we go in disguise and sneak inside, then we're probably not getting in anytime soon. Oh well, someday. Are we dead set on making all of Brandon's dreams come true? <laughs> I think so. This is this the is entrance, entrance to the Noko Mastery Club. I'll just take it, sorry. I was gonna give, make it really be. I was gonna make it be really, yeah. Also, these mushrooms on the wall. Can we talk to them? Make them like bouncers. Me. me. Wall shrooms. Excuse me. Can you move? I'm too tired to move. Too tired. Wow, what a mood. Do you want some coffee? What? No, we don't drink coffee. Do you want a 10 hour energy drink? You have a 10 hour energy drink? You're not allowed to drink that stuff. No, it was more of a hypothetical question. I don't want to move. Richard squirreled the place and peed the floor side to traffic. Excuse me. I bet <laughs> all you do all day is dig around the dirt like a dumpus. <laughs> not a dumpus. It's okay, Mr. Saito. We'll come back later. This guy has an attitude problem. It's not my fault. The Megamori took over my favorite sleeping place. If he leaves for good, I'll go back. <sighs> you know what we gotta do. Yeah. We gotta go talk to these other these other shrooms. See if they say anything of this irregular. No. Uh, we gotta talk what about to the other shrooms. Shroom? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very important. Neat. Yeah. Yeah, good, good thing we did that. I, I would have really said yeah. this. <gasps> so, riveting conversation. <gasps> Hi! Truth. These are weird looking footprints. Uh, I remember you from the last game. What does it do? Uh, it's the same one. It might be a different one. Oh, a senior citizen tree. Maybe it's a different one. So I remember I seeing these trees last good. time. Oh, Ooh. finally, a visitor. Did you know that I have at least 10 feet and I'm growing new ones all the time? I didn't know that. Did you know that you shouldn't eat holiday scented candles even if you really want to? I don't know what that is, but my feet <laughs> tell me all sorts of interesting things. Like what? Oh, can you guess what a Minamori's favorite snack is? Cake? Those? Candy. Getting warmer. Chocolate. Warmer, warmer. Chocolate cake. You're so close, but no. The answer is... Linoleum middle propyl. Ah, excuse me, excuse phosphate. me. Don't steal my line. <laughs> Linoleum monoropyl propylipolyodium chlorophosphate. Chloride phosphate. Of course. What? How is that like chocolate cake? Chocolate cake? Oh, I thought you said soap. <laughs> Their favorite snack is actually hand sanitizer wipes. If only we knew a place we'd get that. And 50% off. Hey, no getting sleepy on the job. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, which have Lino's other profile, Pijil Dilmaloyan. 
Chloramide phosphate. I see. Good effort. <laughs> I just, yeah, I'm just gonna. He's less cheery than the last one we've dealt with. Oh, hello. Look. A minimori. When we can't get to, right? Oh. <gasps> oh. 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 Waterfall. Don't worry, Mr. Saito. He appears to be friendly. I'm not strong enough. You don't have to carry him, but I want to find out why he's there. Okay. Wait, are these his footprints? He must have such cute little feet. I'm surprised he could actually... Hmm, feet. Okay, How can he gonna... carry all that body? <laughs> Look, he like he takes a couple steps and he plops down. <laughs> it makes sense though, doesn't it? Actually, that is exactly yeah. what happened here. Look. He's so large, uh, yeah. <laughs> that's exactly what happened. Oh God! Before, before making his final destination, <laughs> and he now tired. he's just like, ah, water, beautiful. Excuse me, sir. Why are you blocking this waterfall? Oh, it's a gigamori. That makes it makes sense. Ooh. I'm not doing it on purpose. I'm so hungry that I got stuck. I do unpredictable things when I'm hungry. I understand completely. Are you saying that in character or out of character? Yes. <laughs> One time I was so hungry that I tried to eat holiday scented candles. Here we go again with the holiday scented candles. <laughs> that was a day that I learned holiday scented candles are made of wax, and wax tastes great. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, please feed me if you can. I mean, I wouldn't mind. I got some alcohol wipes. <laughs> that is, that is um, Minamori's favorite food. What's up with this one in the boat? I assume that when we get the big one to move, the water level will rise and we'll be able to get that smaller one as well. Oh, you assume? <sighs> yes, I assume. <laughs> Hi there, friend. Ooh, glow shroom. Oh, it's Brandon. <laughs> oh, hey guys, what are you doing out here? collecting rocks the farmer's cleaning his hut today so he made us leave so we're collecting rocks stop saying that what kind of rocks rocks we can use as tokens for our next wizardry the rallying game Ooh. remember wizardry right Brandon it's that game where I beat you by like 200 life. Brandon let you win. Eh, what are you? Some kind of dumpus? Dumpus? How dare beat you? Brandon. He let you win. Anyways, we didn't have much time to do this. Just north of the room you came from is a Gigamori that's blocking a waterfall. Who knows when he'll leave? This place will flood again. A dumpus rock. <laughs> he will leave shortly. We just, need, we just need to find some branch. Indeed. You're probably going to call it to me, aren't you? Honestly, yeah, he did pretty, sure. pretty good with the walking at this point. Like, he was walking there just fine. He didn't slam down every few seconds. Yeah. He'd he slam down hungry. once here. So that's fair. And he didn't say that again. I think he did pretty well for himself. This was a pretty long stretch before he had to sit back down that's again. True, yeah. I took yeah. some stamina to get there. Good on him. Oh. Ooh. Llama worm, it is I, undefined. Hi. He must really like math a lot. Um, well, yes, of of course, math is beautiful. I mean, he's not wrong. Mm. Hmm. Now please, I have a very important message, so listen closely. In a room full of Minimori, there is one thing you must do in order to avoid certain death. <laughs> no, wait, not certain death. <laughs> certain math. Is it Think like a Minamori? What's he talking about, Mr. Saito? 
I don't know. If you want to survive certain math, you must solve the following riddle. I've got to guess. What has a head but no? Oh no. Oh no. What has a bzz, but never a bzz, bzz, math? Uh oh. Uh, are you still there? Hmm. I wonder what happened. Hmm. I'm sorry, I spilled lemon lime soda all over my wires. I have to go clean this up. What about our clue to avoid certain math death? Um, yeah. Think like a Minamori. <laughs> It's always the fucking same puzzle, this guy, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> At least it keeps it simple. It does. It does. Let's not overthink it. Wow. That was tough. Fantastic it was puzzle. definitely certain, certain math def. Oh my gosh. Ah. Don't worry, Mr. Saito. I believe in you. Ah. My dying? I feel like my connection's dying. Again. I hope not. Uh, we'll see. You got the Megamori? Uh, oh my god, so strong. Hell yeah, the, the music. music. Going on. <laughs> Look at his oh. face! <laughs> <laughs> He's so creepy. Oh, I love He's turned it. to a real grumpus. Mm -hmm. Aww. Anywhere? I think in that one right there. Yeah, that's a good one. Okay. Now what? Nothing else happened, right? I hope you can find lots of Minamoro. Should we go back in there now and something will have changed? Ah, yes. Because of the Minamoro was in his favorite sleeping spot, remember? Oh, no, you can go on the other side, yeah. Yeah, so if we go back, he's probably sleeping over here again now. It's a long way to go just to talk to someone who hates us. Oh. <laughs> there he is. Um. Oh, I was happy. This is my favorite place. Aww. Yeah, he definitely feels a little bit more happy now, yes. I'm very Love impressed that. that he knew it was already. Yeah. Alright, let's go find some, some bark. We've got two more Minamori in here. Oh, there's one. Oh, it's another one. These Minamorios really love you, Mr. Saito. Yeah. Okay, at least it's an easy one. Not too heavy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here goes the music again. The music looks very unhappy. No, no, the music's different this time. Yeah, it's all, but it's fun. <laughs> Gotta change up. Okay, good. It's and good to see. One. Yeah. I I'm getting there, God. I can only dig so fast. This mm -hmm, is like mm -hmm. what if what if there was a society of diglets? Right. <laughs> uh Oh no. Oh no, is this who I I think it's what is it? It might be the same guy in the calculator. Look, he's got a math pendant. Oh. Come here, llama worm. Me? Yes, you. Mm. <laughs> kind of speaks. If you want to open the door above me, you must correctly answer my riddle. Are you prepared? Is it odd numbers? I'm prepared. Okay. Here we go. What has a heart but no beat? A large trunk but no seat. Um, let me just uh, take a sip of that so I can reread it when we go on to the next line. Hmm. A 
head, but no brain. A big heart, but no train. Oh no, no train? Wait, does trains usually have heart? Oh, okay. Wait. Wait. Give me a moment. What drinks water but never thirsts, drinks all day long but never laughs? My co workers? <laughs> Wait, no, that's that's not it. I just snipped all of these useless bloody riddles. <laughs> hold, hold on. What has a bed but never thinks? What has a brain but five times seven? Thirty thirty-five? <laughs> uh, I'm never gonna get it right. Oh. I'm a bad sphinx. Oh. No 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 no. You're not a bad sphinx. This is closing all my snips. I don't think I'm gonna need them. <laughs> I'm a bad sphinx. No, not at all. You just need a little practice. Right, Mr. Saito? Uh, yeah. I... <laughs> you think so? Uh, of course. Being a sphinx is hard work. Writing riddles and guarding doors and stuff. That's not easy. I, I'm kind of good at basic math. Oh, yeah? Well, before you guys got here, I was actually writing some math problems. Sort of as a backup test. You know, just in case I couldn't remember the riddle. Oh, God. That totally makes sense. I wrote the math problems on those stone tablets, and then I wired them up to the door. So that when you answer them correctly... The door will open, and I'll get to say... You may pass! Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Are you the one who's been talking to us through the calculators? <laughs> Indeed, you, you have figured me out. My name is Undefined Sphinx of Math. Fuck it. What a title. <laughs> I also could have been a Sphinx of Electrical Engineering. I did set up all those calculator intercoms. But when all said and done, I'm slightly better at basic math, so I went with that. <laughs> Understandable. You know, I'm gradually transforming this cave into an ed, ed dungeon. Edgy dungeon. Edgy dungeon. Wow. What? An edgy dungeon. An educational dungeon. That seems really Ooh. impractical for all the people who live here, including that entire bloody club that was back there. <laughs> I see. As you may have noticed, it's a work in progress. I've also noticed that all of your math problems are really basic and shit. <laughs> I only have a few rudimentary things set up so far. I've kind of got this odd theme going on. Yeah, we've noticed. Yeah, it's great. Very thematic. You think so? Oh yeah, totally. Sure. Oh man, thank you so much. You don't know how much that means to me. You see, my goal is to teach everyone about how cool math is. Do you love math? Uh, so to open the door, we have to solve the math problems on the stone tablets. I knew it sounded stupid. I'm a bad sphinx. No, no, it's a great idea! I kind of like basic math. R r really Of course! So you try to solve my math problems? Oh, I don't know, they might be very hard. Sure! Oh, it's the pie first. Ah, I see you found my delicious pie pie! Approximately 3.141592653596 Scylla cherries were used to make it. I feel like you could break that down to Not a few more fractions. Cherries. Let's see. No, it's not very many cherries at all, really, is it? 
No, not enough for a pie. Mm. Three cherries alone do mm. not make a pie. 22 oh, divided this by is 2. So hard oh. math. <laughs> 3 squared. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Can't figure that one out. Uh, <laughs> just just kidding. kidding. It's five. <laughs> just a little sphinx humor. I'm working with what I got. God damn it, man. <laughs> okay. Uh, so we got five plus four. So five plus one is, is six. Plus four is ten. Seven. Oh, I got that without actually. I just read the answers. <laughs> but I do like right. doing math. Square root Weird of out. 81. Impossible! Oh. Nice. 17, negative 4. Negative 4. 1 plus 7. I thought these are really <laughs> basic. You sounded like a discount GLaDOS just then. Who? Uh, your internet stuffed up and you sound like a discount GLaDOS. Oh no, is it working better now? It is, but before you sound like a discount GLaDOS. Oh uh, no. Uh oh. Okay. Uh -oh. oh, here comes the horror element. Oh no. Mr. Saito, I didn't know. Oh, they're in boy here. Oh no. Grandma says that in boy spirits stuck between worlds. Yeah, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Your internet seems to be dying on us. Do you want to just take a few moments and see if it clears up? It usually comes and goes. Now this is the first time in two hours it's happened. Yes, it is. Okay. Okay. Yeah, now it's better. You want me to reread that? Yes, yes, I do. Sorry. Take two. <laughs> and Most of them action. are harmless. <laughs> Most of them are harmless. Just passing through or hanging around until they figure things out, you know? Yes. But sometimes they're corrupted by bad energy. What do you mean? Well, Grandma says that people are sometimes haunted by things. Not like ghosts or anything, but like... Bad feelings, you know? Like when someone is so afraid or so angry, they can't think about anything else. Or when someone feels so empty inside that they forget who they are. Are you haunted by anything, Mr. Saito? Oh wow, this has gone dark. <laughs> so, so deep all of a sudden. <laughs> yeah, what kind of kid asks these sorts of questions? Hmm? No. Okay, good. We'd better be careful here. Oh, I want to go talk to my right. new friends. Mm -hmm. The haunted spirits. Oh, there's oh, there's plenty. Can you touch yeah. them? Yeah, I'm going to assume we don't want to touch them. Right, that's fair. Is it... Yeah, that's. <gasps> oh no, you're back. <laughs> oh, I definitely do not want to be near the the math sphinx. No. Oh, He's wow. So <laughs> he turns around really quickly, okay? You can do it. I believe in you. I mean, I thought I could too, but now I'm questioning my own abilities or lack thereof. I also didn't know when that one's going to come back across. Uh, nothing there? There was someone there. This one's just, oh. oh, there he is. Okay. Just hiding in the shadows. Apparently so. There's two ways. There's this way, which doesn't appear to go anywhere. Oh, it's mushrooms. Oh. oh. Thanks for getting us through that, Mr. Saito. 
Oh. What's wrong? You know what the puzzle is? I'm guessing it's gonna be odds? Yep. Hmm. I couldn't have done that without you. <sighs> okay, we got to our calculator friend, though. Alright. Maybe disappointed Maybe we didn't. Technical issues work yeah, together. Yeah, see. Hi, guys! It, it is I, Undefined. Undefined <laughs> is so much less cool now we know who they are. <laughs> Once again, communicating to you across the void through mathematics. Pretty sure that's not how you're communicating. You said it was a PA system. It's mathematics. How do you even get a calculator to work as an intercom? You definitely could have been a sphinx of electrical engineering. Yeah, you're like really smart. <laughs> okay, let's not, let's not say yeah, all that. that far. <laughs> Mr. 1 plus 7. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, I, uh, wow, I mean, wow, thank you so much. Oh, I, it's probably a good thing he can't hear us. <laughs> oh my gosh, wait, I I think I just thought of a new riddle. Oh, boy. oh, let's hear it. Okay, here goes nothing. You can do this. You're the Sphinx of Math. One hand, long like a llama worm. One hand, short like a cave bug. Measuring something that flies like a minamori. What am I? The clock. That's your clue. And once you know the answer, think like a Minamori. Okay, so we're clocking it. Yep. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <sighs> Come on, guys. <laughs> Yay, puzzles. I saw someone in the Steam forums who was asking, what do you do with the clock puzzle? And it's like, really? Someone responded, do you know the other ones? I'd be very impressed, to be honest. Think like a Minamori. I'm gonna go use this guy to go back to the front. Cheater. What? I just saved myself some time. That's cheating. No holds barred. I know, I wonder if they're playing soon. Mr. Saito, look, it's a poster for No Holds Barred. Whenever they come out with a new song, I always memorize Little Buds' part. Yeah. Ooh. You gotta pick it up. I do. Get that little guy out of here. Mm, mm, mm. This bloody sphinx. <laughs> Game my, my workout today. Oh, yeah. All right. Now there's only one yeah, Minamori what? unaccounted for. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm We've seen the big one. We know where that's gonna go. We see the little one in the boat. That means only one more Minamori left that we haven't found. I still got more places to explore. Indeed. Oh, never mind. <gasps> found him. Oh. Yeah. Easy. I, that was easy. <laughs> Mega Mori music. <laughs> kind of really want to see what happens if he did pick up the biggest one. This really is a lovely ch soundtrack. Mm -hmm. right, can we go down here? Now can we go to the sign. Okay. There we go. We're nice. fine. Now internet. back through the cave. Yeah. Well, it's just before it was cutting out a little bit, so I thought we might have to pause for a second. It seems like it's fine at the moment. Oh. <sighs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Mr. Saito. Are you okay? I wonder what the puzzle's gonna be here. Brandon, that's my boss up there. What's he doing here? Do you want me to throw something at him? What? Of course! He's my boss! Okay, just making sure. Saito, is that you? 
Oh no, oh no, oh no. Saito, I need your help. Please come here. I'll explain my situation. Yes, sir. Don't care they haven't been at work. So I, I have no excuse to be late to the office today. I will work. Saito, please. Find my golf balls. What? I'm in such a pickle, you see. I took new clients to golf, play golf today. Everything was going quite well until... Sir? Come closer. I don't want to say anything that's too loudly. I... I got a hole in one during today's golf game! <gasps> Saito, you cannot tell anyone about this. I... I don't have hole-in-one golf insurance. I knew it. Oh no! What's hole-in-one golf insurance? I is this your small pink son? <laughs> no, no, sir. Hole-in-one golf insurance is very important. In golf, if a hole-in-one is very lucky, so you're expected to buy your friends and colleagues a lots of gifts to get you one when you get one. Expensive gifts. I see. Like bars of gold. Precisely. Uh, the clients saw my fantastic swing, but before they could confirm the results, I gathered all the golf balls on the green and threw them in a ravine. Told the clients that the bear had eaten them. I came down here to dispose of the evidence, but these Minamori, they're playing tricks on me. They hit my golf balls and surround me with stone statue versions of themselves. <laughs> you have to help me, Saito. And small pink son of Saito. <laughs> okay, two golf girls push them into this bottomless pit over there. As you can see, I assemble a nice ramp using train tracks that were given to me by clients. They're top quality train tracks, Saito! Let's see. Find two golf balls and push them off the train track ramp into the bottomless pit. If you do, I'll give you this lovely relic I found here. It's some sort of redstone key. Y yes, sir. Why must I be so talented? Huh. <laughs> this freaking guy. I know, right? You mean like a Minamori, you say? Oh. Yeah. As you oh. should. I'll just knock that into the ravine. Yeah, going to. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh. I'm try to. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. uh -oh. Is there a way to reset it? <laughs> Uh-oh! Uh-oh, indeed. Oh. What have you done? I've ruined it. The I whole game is ruined. I can't believe you've done this. Okay, we're good. We reset it. Now, the more important thing is, can I do it properly this time without ruining everything? I think you guys gotta push it sideways one block sooner. Can't do it now. I do it there. Then move it sideways. Move it down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's fine. Perfect. Fine. We can beat this basic puzzle. Hole in 19! Oh. Oh, it's actually counting. Oh, good thing I can't get a hole in one, huh? Eh. Eh. <laughs> You'll get it eventually. Yeah, I don't know why that ha was so difficult for me. <laughs> Whew. Oh, that's a tough one. It is a very tough puzzle. I don't know why you'd want in the bottomless pit. Hole in 15! Fantastic work, Saito! As promised, here's the relic I found. It's a good thing you somehow knew you need to be here to help your boss. Good practice decision making, Saito. Uh, <laughs> what happens if I put them in the wrong rock? Nothing, Nothing. apparently. Okay. Can I? Can I just... I'll put it down either, so I'm taking this with me. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Strange force. Oops. It doesn't want me to take um the thing with me. Yeah, you can't steal them. Oh, but I want to take one. What if I need one in future? Right. Well, this will be where we'll find the. One would imagine this will be where we'll find the uh, bark we need. Mhm. Mm
Well, well, what do we have here? Some adventures, perhaps. Come rest your feet and have some tea. Thank you for knowing that my feet are tired. <laughs> Is it okay, Mr. Saito? Can we rest here for a bit? Do you know her? Not personally, but she's an Aunt Onion. Aunt Onions are always nice. Okay, sure. I mean, are they, though? What brings you two here today? We're trying to find the flooded gemstone caverns. If we carry enough Minamori back to their meeting ground, the door to the caverns will open. Well, isn't that exciting? You two must be very strong. Yes, both of us are incredibly strong. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mr. Saito is very strong. He even carried a Megamori. <laughs> so this llama worm is helping you? Yes, he's so nice. He's skipping work today to help me fulfill my dream. And I know that means a lot because he has a really important job. He works for Saito Corp making buttons for the underground tunnels. Well, isn't that just wonderful, dear? What a nice young man. Can I just point out? Hmm? Oh, that's all. I know what this song is. Um, and second of all, we haven't seen a single button since we've been down here. Maybe not these tunnels. There must be other tunnels, I suppose. He thinks... He? Oh, he... Wait, he thinks I have an important job? Must be branded, I guess. I was gonna say. Yeah. Would you both like a cup of tea? Yes, please. Uh, thank you. Alright, then. Help yourself to some cookies, too. Oh. Most buds your age wouldn't want to have tea with an old Aunt Onion like me. Oh, most of my friends are senior citizens. Oh god. They are? <laughs> well, that's interesting. Why is that? Well, my grandma is kind of a young grandma, so she has to work. She cooks food at an old folks home, so sometimes I get to go there and hang out with everyone. We talk and watch TV together. Sometimes we play cards. But I gotta be careful with that. Uh... Some grandpas there get really upset about losing, so I try to let them win. Huh. That's very big of you. You don't mind losing? Not at all. I think the whole reason to play games is to have fun. So I don't mind losing if it means everyone can have fun. Indeed. What kind of kid is this? Letting adults win so their feelings aren't hurt? That seems backwards. Really, the only thing I don't like about having mostly senior citizen friends? Oh, he just turns around and says the smell? That would be hilarious. <laughs> Ew. You have to get used to saying goodbye a lot. Oh, oh God. <laughs> what a bummer. It's so much darker than I thought. <laughs> saying goodbye is never easy. Grandma said I have a lot of practice for someone my age. Oh, God! <laughs> but that's okay. Because I believe they're in a better place, and someday I'll get to see them again. Oh, dear. Thank you for the tea and cookies. Of course. Thank you for sitting with an old on onion for a little while. Oh, before you go, help yourselves to what's in that treasure chest. Oh, over I was there. planning on it. Maybe it'll help you on your adventure. I have a feeling it'll be some bark. I hope we'll meet again someday. We will. Ooh. Oh, look at that! The king hunks of tree chunk chips. chips. <laughs> I admit, neither this game nor Raccoon are exactly known for their difficulty. <laughs> That's fair. I don't really like difficult games. Yes, well, um, this one specifically is uh, very much... These games are just known for their charming 
and often hard hittingness. So nothing sad has happened so far in this game, but you never know with these sort of games. There's enough of them now that they're these sort of games, like To the Moon, mm -hmm. Finding Paradise. You know, like there's a certain pattern now. Mm -hmm. Anyway, like a vibe. yeah. Welcome to Saito Mart. Welcome to Saito Mart. Can I interest uh, you in today's sale item? Hand sanitizer wipes are fifty percent off. <gasps> that smell. Do you have decaying chunks of tree trunk trunks in your person? <laughs> it's. I mean, it is a mushroom. I shouldn't be surprised, but it's still funny. It on you. <laughs> yeah. Maybe we do. Does that sweeten the deal? Oh yes, I would gladly trade you my trade you my hand sanitizer wipes for such a delicacy. Okay, so like, does your boss know? Are, is your boss okay if you like handing out merchandise for free, or are you just gonna pay for it? <laughs> no money required. It's a deal. Also makes me wonder. Maybe it's worth more. I feel like I might have just been quite, uh, like completely ripped off. Hey, you might have given away uh, like something. Really costly. Aww. Oh, they're all gone. You're right, Brandon. They all left. They're so mysterious. Mm. Box of supplies. Box of sweet and sports drinks. Browse. Box of supplies. Box of curry. An empty mm. bucket. Box of side new branded instant noodles. All right, well, we know what this is for. God damn, this, this is this a person's entire job? Oh wait, we never did go into the train station. Like, I thought that was where we meant to go, so we didn't go there? Oh, this leads to Saito commuter trains. Best to get clear for now. Don't want anyone to see me skip work. I mean, literally your boss has seen you skip work. But because he's so egotistical, he's just like, Ah, you're here to help me with work. Fantastic. <laughs> like, seriously. <laughs> now, I'm going to assume that the big guy will fly on his own. Or go on mm -hmm. his own. So we've probably only got the little one to save. This little guy. Alright, let's get some more water. Here you go, friend. Do you like some delicious sanitizer wipe? Please feed me if you can. Oh, he's just a big guy. And sanitizer wipes. These are my favorite. Aw, here he goes. Bye. I hope he goes to where we need him to go. Right. <sighs> um. That one's voted away. Sail away, sweet prince. Wait, no. We need that Minamori. <laughs> After that boat. We're going, we're digging as fast as we can. <sighs> oh. I'm so proud of you, Mr. Saito. Meanwhile, Mr. Saito is not proud of his own life decisions. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say this is much better than a day at work. Oh yeah, much better. Is that why you're skipping work right now? <laughs> uh, I don't work today, silly. I know, I know. That's why I asked. I asked if there was any time. Uh. <laughs> all right, all right. It's fine. It's okay, fine. So Here we go. Maybe we need to go in the final. No, we can't open the final door until that last guy's there. I can't believe you found six Minamori. You guys are amazing. Mr. Saito is incredible. You should have seen him. I did see him, and he is incredible. Aww. Aww. <laughs> he belongs in a museum. <laughs> Are you offering me a job? I'm just not sure how we're going to get that last one. Huh. Huh. Hello! Uh, 
Where'd you come from? The dirt. Did I hear you're looking for a Minamori? Yes, we are. Check the Kanoko Matsuri Club. There's one in there right now. Man, how are we going to get them to let us in? Why don't you wear a disguise or something? Ooh, do I get to take his hat? Ooh, that's a great idea. Oh my gosh, I could dress up as little buds. You do look a lot like him. It's true. Thank you so much. If you were dressed as little buds, they'd let you in for sure. I'd just have to find some sunglasses. I think I saw some sunglasses at the Satori accessory store. Is that the place next to the Saito Mart in the train station? Yes! <laughs> Woo! Come on, let's go get you this guy. So I'm gonna say, we could just take him hat. I'd like to take that hat. So he's had the. The game hasn't been that long, you'd think. You'd think that people should remember that. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We've and got a Rubik's Cube, some llama ones, and solve this puzzle quickly. I mean, apparently we didn't since we had to trade for the bloody. Um... Yeah, so I'm curious how this is going to work out. Yeah. I heard that some Sky Buds actually eat roses. Maybe he feels like this is actually worth paying for now. Ties are okay. Huh? This tie has little de desserts all over it. Aw, he's I so love excited. this tie. These ties are okay. I'm self-conscious about my stripes. Who isn't? Who Aww, isn't? your stripes. A wrist adverse indoor plant. <laughs> Got one more plant over there to talk to. Talk to every everyone but the cashier, first of all. As you do in a store usually. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you, you talk to the plants plant. first. Yeah, and course. then you address <laughs> the clerk. Yeah. yeah, of course. Welcome to Saito Sex Sex Saito Accessories. Why can't oh, I say God. that? You found the accessory on the store for Saitos. Please feel free to browse our high quality products. I am interested in high quality products. Do you have to buy them with money? <laughs> hmm. Um, yes, of course. That's too bad. You know, I myself am in the accessory business. I make friendship <laughs> bracelets. See this pattern? I made it up last week. I think it looks very stylish. Ooh. That is stylish. The colors were actually inspired by labels. That's why I decided to use pink and lavender string. Ooh, I really like that one. I actually have a client that collects label crafts. <laughs> is that so? Would you, by chance, be willing to trade a bracelet for, say... That pair of sunglasses over there? I think I'd be willing to make that trade. Oh god. Fantastic! Here's one Liebel friendship bracelet and... Say, would you be willing to trade another friendship bracelet for that purple tie over there? The one with all the desserts on it? <laughs> hmm. Yes, I think I can do that. Great, it's a deal. Oh god. Here are your bracelets, courtesy of Cave Bud Crafts. Tell your friends, enjoy. <laughs> Feel free to help yourself to your new accessories. Aww. Hi, Mr. Saito. I negotiated. Very entrepreneurial of you. Does that mean you can get these sunglasses now? 
Yes, and you can get that purple dessert tie that you really like so much. <gasps> what tie? You're funny, Mr. Saito. I traded a friendship bracelet for it. The tie's yours now. You should try it on. <sighs> well, go on. Well, let's see it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, so cool. That is definitely my the way I de define cool. I sure, for sure. Yeah. Oh, ah. I see You look great. This tie has donuts and slices of cake on it, just like white toast cakes. He traded one of his little sandmade bracelets so I could have this tie. What a nice thing to do. You're giving up your literal entire day to help this kid. Right? Are you okay, Mr. Saito? Oh, come on, Brandon. Go put on your new sunglasses. Brandon transforms into... Little Buds. Oh. Let's go to the Kanoko Matsuri Club. Oh yeah, little buds go. What an adventure. It is, it really is. Such a great adventure. <laughs> I love how his art is sticking on him. It's just there now. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> With how a few of these wear clothing as well, it's like such a fashion statement, you know? Right, yeah, it really stands out. It might actually lead to him getting a new nickname when you think about it. Oh, true. Yeah. Snazzy toe. Mm, yes. Can I do the guards? I forgot what hey. we did with the guards. Well, you did one. You did one right when I was about to do it. I was gonna give him a big, thick, fir firm voice, and you gave it a nice, like, upbeat, like, like mushroomy voice. Hey there! Where do you think you're going? <laughs> yeah, they just look so intimidating. Yo. <gasps> Little buds? Who do you think I was? Some kind of hooligan? No, no, not at all, sir. Sir, we just, we didn't see you at first. Al Zeros, apologies. Apologies accepted. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh, but of course, please go right in. What? Wait! Who's that with you? We don't have a llama worm on our guest list. He's our backup dancer. <gasps> I see. Alright then, go on in. Have a good show. Good job, Brandon. I really love this tie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we're actually here. <laughs> is that the music group you like? It, it is. There's so it much is. happening here. <laughs> There's bears. Mm. Uh, Mori. No holds barred. <laughs> <It's> sunglasses. <laughs> I am so happy that my sunglasses fell off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they're back on again. Mr. Saito, look. It's the final Minamori. That's that. By Minamori, I actually mean Gigamori. G Gigamori. Is it gonna be okay, Mr. Saito? I guess we'll find out. Oh. Hey, some weirded be bearded llama worm keeps asking me to be on his reality show. <laughs> oh, hey, Tony. Hey, look, he's there. He wants to see, he says he wants to dangerously audit me. Bears don't pay taxes. Oh, but you will. <laughs> you will. <laughs> An indoor ha houseplant which has memorized the first thousand digits of pie. He's lost your time these days. Oh, I can believe it. Pan's been hoarding paperclips. Shh. Aww. 
I'm having the curry special. It's Mont Black Blank with chestnut coconut filling. That sounds pretty good, actually. Oh, hey! Yeah. Saw me! Even a water dragon needs to go to a concert every now and then. I like it when everyone does the wave. Aw, oh, the buns here are definitely not cold. <sighs> <laughs> Wow, are you a real llama worm? I live in the Skyland, so I've never met a llama worm before. Do llama worms wear pants? Uh, no, we wear sing a singular pant. Whoa. The show will the be show starting short. I'm sorry. Nah, you're fine. We're just, we're winging it. Have you ever eaten dirt moose? Yes. Once. There's a layer of soil, then mud, then more soil, then more mud. It's delectable. I come here for the mud lattes and the music. These are all Ew. characters from Raccoon as well, by the way. Oh, Very nice. Very respectable old plant. And in all plants, that has good understanding of organic chemistry. That's cool. Ooh, you got an achievement unlock for talking to plants. I did. Good thing I didn't miss any. <laughs> <laughs> I feel so rad doing our civic duty and being at Kenoki Matsuri Club. King Spore is totally tubular. He invited us to this super rad concert tonight. Hey, what you looking at? It's a green donut, okay? You look like you never seen anyone eat green donuts. It's a green donut, okay? Green donut that's shaped like a cabbage. Get off my back! Okay, dang. Oh, King's oh, somebody else. Um, whoa there! It's Long Dune and Little Dune. Welcome to the club. Eee! Today there's a special guest performing with No Holds Bar. I think his name is Yakutabug? Anyways, enjoy the show, long dude, little dude. Oh, sweet. Hey, you over there! Huh? Uh... I don't remember seeing a llama worm on today's guest list. Oh, rude. Mr. Llama Worm, sir? Me? Yeah, you. Come over here. I need to talk to you. It's okay, Mr. Saito. If things get rough, we can make a run for it. We do need the, uh, Inamori first. Sir, I'm gonna need you to verify that you're on today's guest list. Well, I feel- I'm feeling personally targeted here. He's my backup dancer. I'd still like to confirm his identity for security purposes. Now, Llama Worm, sir, if you could please tell me your name. My name? Don't give him your real name, Mr. Saito. Yes, what is your name? Snazto. Mm hmm. I gotta come up with one. Make up a good fake name. Uh, um. Your name, please. Saito. No! His name is Dorlando! <laughs> Dorlando. Oops. You're an imposter! Mm. What's going on? Someone acting a fool? Oh no, I have to help Brandon. Uh, uh -huh. <laughs> uh, hey everyone! Look over here! <laughs> My name's Saito. Haha, <laughs> yes indeed. Mr. Saito. Ah. Haha. -ha. Now that is some mighty fine dancing. Oh. <gasps> it's Look. Little Buds himself. Little, Little Buds. That's my name. What's yours? I'm Brandon. Nice to meet you, Brandon. We look a lot alike. We could be twins. 
<laughs> so, Llama Worm, you said your name is Saito? Yes. I like your style, man. I ain't never seen moves like that before. You're a good dancer, Saito. Wow. Oh, he's so happy. So, why'd you guys sneak in? We're really sorry. It's just that... We're on a mission to bring Minamori back to their ancient meeting ground. If we do, a path might open to the flooded gemstone caverns. I've been wanting to go there my whole life. It might be my only chance to go. He's really brave. So you're saying that you want to move that Gigamori over there? Yes. Uh. That seems pretty reasonable to me. I don't see why we can't let you do that. Thank you so much! But before you do... How would you two like to come up on stage and join us for our next song? Oh my gosh. What? Really? Oh, who's the sunflower? It's you, really upbeat and happy. Oh. Yeah, you two got style. <laughs> what you did back there? That was so chaotic good like us. Yeah, high five. I'm so happy I feel like I'm gonna die and then barf. Come on up here. Yeah! Aha! Oh. Ah, what a great band. Have fun. Aww. Show them your moves, Saito. I'm doing my best. Look at me. Yeah. Do the do the wiggly. The wiggle worm. Woo! Ah! No hold barred! Ah! ah, best band ever. Oh my god, it's the hold barred! Oh! But a plan has to grow. Now we're stepping on the scene and the lights start to glow. Yeah, I don't mean disrespect. I just want to keep it real. Gotta change the subject. This here is a tea party, in case you didn't know. The party is on, and I think that you'll like that. We're bringing a hype. <laughs> Song, raising a stink on the mic, but extending the love. Aww. So the story is long, and I bet we'll be best of buds if you're impressed with the funk since the bars are the bomb. But you are in the wrong if you think you're better than us. Don't poo poo the recipe of our musical pedigree. Like Don't poo poo the recipe. Dance down, feet on the ground. We don't even care at all. Fancy kings and queens, that's not a scene. It's a tea party. The Little Buds hasn't sung yet. Not yet. Gonna be the main song. There we go. There we go. and be part of the beef, consuming the beef. Oh man. <laughs> little Buds got bars. Yeah. Sunflower raps too? Apparently so, yeah. She's so talented. Very. <laughs> Wait. Why are they singing about my workmates? <laughs> right? How do they know them? <laughs> yeah, make up your mind. She's just right on time. Whoa. <laughs> Who is that? You can find out if you ever play Rakuen. Fancy kings and queens. That's not our city. Come and dance with me. Aww. I feel like this is something I'm going to have to go back and record separately and upload separately. 
Your fan out talking over it. It's kind of cute. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> Saito! Saito! You can do it, Mr. Saito. <laughs> Saito! Saito! Is there no other way to get this bird out of there? <laughs> I mean, it looks like he's kind of busy. Break your back. Yeah. <sighs> Mr. Saito, you're amazing. Uh, you guys actually open. Sorry. <clears throat> you guys actually open the door. I've never seen something like this before. An ancient Minamori meeting ground. Filled with Minamori. This is fantastic. I can tell they're happy too. I wouldn't have had it any other way. Well, now that we have a full house, I certainly have my work cut out for me. I'm gonna make this the best Minamori cafe in the whole underground. So tell me, do Minamori have a transformative power? Have you learned more about yourself? About life, about inner length, and inner strength. Where's my, where's my tie gone? No. I think Mr. Taito has definitely gotten stronger. <laughs> so, Brandon, are you ready to see your flooded gemstone caverns? Mm, one million percent ready. Have fun, you two, and thanks again. You come back and visit, okay? Okay. Goodbye, goodbye, Archaeolito. Where's my tie, though? I like, I like my tie. It should have been sure to tie it on stronger so it didn't fall off when I was carrying something. White Toe didn't even get to see our tie. Give it away. I'm sure he'll, he'll take it to work with him. I hope so. Does he even have pockets? I don't know. I don't know those things. Oh. Look, I'm in Amori! Ooh, ooh. Right, Brandon. This is beautiful. One of the people I met at Grandma's work, his name was Mr. Sasaki. He lived to be 87 years old and said the only regret he ever had was that he never biked to the Lumen Rock Canyon. He said that at night, something special would happen. stones in the canyon would glow so brightly that you didn't even need a light. But he put it off and put it off. And once he finally had the time, his body didn't work anymore. He looked so sad when he told me this. That's when he made me promise to visit my dream place. That's why I had to come here. It wasn't just for me. It was for him, too. Aww. So you, uh, spend a lot of time with the old folks home where your grandma works? Yeah. Well, before Morizora said I had to stay behind, at least. I spend a lot of time there. What was it like? There's always someone to talk to. <laughs> Want to know something I learned there, Mr. Saito? Sure. Old people have done a lot of things because they're very old. That, yeah, yeah, fair. <laughs> Brandon. One lady traveled around the world and saw pyramids and a giant lizard. Okay, did, did she have pictures of the giant lizard? I'd like to see the giant lizard. Right. One guy was famous for a while because he wrote a song that got really popular before I was born. Yeah. <laughs> One guy even built real trains. Whoa! I need to meet I that know. guy. Like, holy hell. 
What a hero. I used to think that doing a lot of stuff like that was what made you happy. Especially if you made a lot of money or were a boss or a famous person. Nah, nah, have fun in life. But I was wrong. Sometimes the happiest old people didn't do anything like that. In fact, the thing that made them so happy was to do nice things for other people. Stuff like washing someone's dishes when they broke their leg, or bringing over soup and playing cards with them if they're sick. Do you want to know what I learned about happiness, Mr. Psycho? The happiest people were the ones who had loved the most. Anyways. Thank you for helping me keep my promise, Mr. Saito. I'll never forget this. Hmm. I think it's time to go now. Aww. I should take the next train back before Grandma gets worried. I'll ride back with you. Really, Mr. Saito? You mean it? Really? Come on, let's get you to the train station. Ah. <laughs> Or I'll be reprimanded and arrested for kidnapping. <laughs> Do you remember how to get back to train station? Yep, it's right next to Saito Mart. Let's go! We can stop at Saito Mart to get some snacks for the trip if you'd like. Really, Mr. Saito? Really? Oh my gosh, I love snacks. Yeah. So why didn't you spend the money on all the things we needed? You know, like... Like the yeah, like, how, how are we going to buy these the, things? The, rap, yeah. the WAPs, yeah. Like, if he's got money this whole time. Welcome to Saito Mart. Welcome to Saito Mart. Do you have any melon pan? Certainly. In fact, I enjoyed the decaying hunks of tree trunks so much that this melon pan is on the house. Oh, um. Oh, that's convenient. I'll throw in some canned coffee, too. I feel like the little kids shouldn't be having coffee. <gasps> Probably not. Ooh. Ooh. I want melon pan. Wait, that's the same thing that was, um... Oh, that's our... what you thought was trumpets? Yeah. Actually melon pan. yeah. Why didn't you just get the free ones from... Okay. <laughs> right? I can hear the train. The train station is right up there. Go, 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 before you miss the train. I wouldn't want to, no. Attention! The train will be arriving shortly. Have we got time to talk to everyone first? Oh god, no, not you. I've got 25 seconds to do it. I've got to talk to him, do it quickly! Hey, Saito, when did you start to work at the same time as me? Always. I've got 17 seconds. Everybody's home. Maybe if I sneak into the office, boss, so I won't notice how late I am. I say woke up late. It's all with hot cold drinks. It's all with hot cold drinks. Okay, looks okay. like that's everything we do right now. Exactly enough time. Attention! Rapid Site 2 train bound for Morizora's cave is approaching. Please stand back in the safe zone and wait. Come on, Mr. Saito, the train is almost here. We're no longer in the underground. So he's just like digging his hole through the train. Yes, a moving train. <laughs> Trains are cool. <laughs> huh. I still have questions about the species. Brandon. I, think I better not think about it. A while back you asked me a weird question. I ask a lot of weird questions. Yeah, that's true, but uh what did I ask you, Mr. Saito? You asked me if I was haunted by anything. At the time I said no, but I lied. The truth is I'm haunted by a lot of things. Some days I feel like no matter what, I'll never be enough. I won't be able to handle things. I'll never be rid of this empty feeling inside of me. The truth is, at some point of our life, we've all felt like everything around me was crumbling, And I really started believing that there was no place for me here. It was too much for me, Brandon. 
So last week I tried to run away from everything. I tried to dig into the center of the world. Mr. Saito. But as luck would have it, I failed. As I was digging, I hit a giant rock. Wouldn't you know it? <laughs> but if I hadn't hit that rock, I would have actually made it to the center of the world. And then I never would have been able to come back. I'd never be able to see the gemstone caverns or ride another train. I never met you. I'm so glad I missed, met you, Mr. Saito. Me too, Brandon. You helped me with so many things. Things I thought I'd never get to do. Maybe someday I can help you with something that's important to you too. Brandon, you already did. Hmm. Aww. Aww, they hug. <laughs> uh, what was that? It felt like the train hit something. Mr. Saito. I think it's time for me to go now. But we haven't gone to the next stop yet. Don't forget me, okay? Brandon, you're disappearing. Goodbye, Mr. Saito. Brandon, wait! I'll never forget you. Goodbye, Mr. Saito. Mr. Saito. Mr. Saito, can you hear me? Mr. Saito. I have good news. All your tests have come back, and it looks as though you're clear to, to leave the hospital today. No, I... Huh. Well, I'm... Are you okay, Mr. Saito? Uh, yes? Yes, I'm... I'm good. Great. Well then, feel free to get changed and gather your belongings. And don't forget to head down to reception to finish up your paperwork. Uh, okay. Uh, doctor didn't even, the other doctor didn't even say anything to me. Nope. <laughs> wow. Just there for support. somewhere? Huh. No. You're all, You're set. all set. Remember, okay, go ahead. if you experience any of the symptoms listed on that sheet, you get, give us a call. Or come in. Well, on the other than that, you should be good to go. Uh, thanks. Today's a new day, and a beautiful one at that. Get out there and enjoy it for me, okay? <laughs> sure thing. Yeah, no more jumping in front of trains. Yeah, no. <sighs> a new day. And a new life. Wow. Aww. Wait! I'm glad I caught you before you left. Is something wrong? No, not at all. It's just that one of our patients was very insistent that we give you this present before you left. He said it took him all afternoon to make it. Huh? Friendship bracelet? Aww. Aww. Get 
get well, Mr. Saito. Love, Brandon. Aww. Aww. So cute. It's time for the credits. <laughs> Good job, Laura Shibihara. Hmm. That's cute stuff. Why is the toilet saying help? <laughs> Wouldn't you say help if you were toilet? Artist and okay at basic math. <laughs> Steven Davis. <laughs> Oh, oh! Music and noises. Okay. It's good that the noises are also made there. Just, yeah. Even more of it. Even more art. <laughs> and a bird in the <laughs> oh. <laughs> Insomniac rap disciple Craig Hall. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Toby Fox did. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> the Minimori engine. <laughs> Huge dumpus. Oh. <laughs> Taxes. <laughs> Maybe it's not the bears should. Oh. Maybe it's the. Oh, look, the, the Sphinx must have been the teacher. You may pass. <laughs> Almost we need an idea of what teacher looks like. Aww. Plants. <laughs> what kind of plant is that one, do you think? What's that one's personality? Best plant. Okay. He's, he's the proud plant. Average potato. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Aww. Just the potatoes. Mm -hmm. I think they're probably the buns from before, but yes. My family, aww. And the gun teacher, Mike. <laughs> aww. <laughs> it's a cool little crystal. Where'd you get that from? Aww. Eating melon pan. Indeed. Hey, I want some <sighs> melon pan. I wish there was somewhere to get melon pan around here. I mean, maybe there is. Have you ever looked? Mm -mm. Well, that looks like that was the game. <laughs> did you like it? Did you like it? Yes, I did. It was really good. <laughs> I mean, I didn't think I said it that weirdly, did I? Uh. Yeah. No, that's just me making fun of you. <laughs> wow. Did you like it? It's because wow. I, I watch a lot of Love Island. That's how they talk. Wow. Anyway... <laughs> Well, thank you for joining me today. This has been Mr. Saito. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I, I had fun too. It wasn't as, as emotional as I was expecting, but it was still a charming story with a lot of love, 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 and a lot of emotion to it. So, yeah. Yeah, and like one of those like takeaway stories where it's like, yeah, maybe I should try to enjoy my life a little bit more and do the things I want to do. Maybe I should get drunk and jump in front of a train. Wait, that wasn't the takeaway. I do wonder that a lot. Yeah. Uh, I don't think Probably there's enough trains here that, that. it would be very useful here. I don't know where the trains are, <laughs> to be quite honest. <laughs> I know there's trains around, I just have <laughs> I assume on the stations. <laughs> on the tracks, I hopefully. I don't know her. Uh, honestly. Uh, okay, well, yeah, I'm going to end the recording for now. Thank you for joining me. Uh, Fush, uh, I, I, you got I, it. We might have to do it again if, if Para ever doesn't want to do something or if you just want to play something. Um, oh, wow. So Para's always first pick. Oh, it's, I'm, it's, just, I'm just second best. It's mostly I'll take you who I can get. <laughs> right, yeah. I'm very ha thankful you were able to join me, though. Yeah, this was really fun. We should do it again. Oh, yeah. I, this, I, this is a lot I agree to another. Woo! <laughs> okay. Well, I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. And this has been Bye, Mr. Everybody. Saito. Link will be in the description. Goodbye.